with you. Yeah, yeah. I feel like I'm at the tippy top of my game, looking down at the rafters. I had the sun these boys can't even Oh, baby. Welcome to the Mixtape Tour Stories. Yes, sir. I have beside me the one, the only. Facts. Facts. Shane the Dribbling Machine. Facts. Yeah. Yeah. Facts. The one. <laughs> my big brother, my OG. Harlem made me. <laughs> Bronx raised me. Yes, sir. Eat late, you Eat lose all. weight. <laughs> Eat a wall. <laughs> Eat a wall. Yo, it's, man, it's great to have you here, man. You know, uh. You know, OG, you know, Shane the Dribble Machine. And, you know, one of the first things we want to ask everybody that's going to be on this show, you being the first one, you know, uh, is, you know, what park you rep? You know, what court you grew up on, what park you rep? You know, whether it's a park, whether it's a gym, you know, because down south, I mean, it's hot as hell, so people don't play outside like that, so it might be a gym. But what court do you rep? What park you rep? I mean, if you if you, if you you're a fan, if you know about the... The, the mixtape, you already know, Bronx, New York, and yes, Sousa Park, Eater Wall Projects. Sousa Park, Eater Wall, 112, the turf, the whole Northeast Bronx. I rap every Bronx, every Northeast Bronx park. Okay. Believe it or not. That's, that's, nobody could say that, but I'm from the Northeast Bronx, and I rep every park there. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, the Bronx. He said every park. Yeah. Every park. So, Dex, you said on the show, yo, we don't give, we don't give flowers. What we give? We give stamps. We don't give flowers. We give guys, you know, guys that really, you know, were, were, were there when street ball was hot, you know, that basically, you know, grew the N1 brand, mm -hmm. you know, with, with, the, with the tour and with, you know, uh, all the stuff they were doing when the street ball culture was hot, you know. So, yeah, we don't, we don't you know, everybody else said we're going to give them their flowers, but here we're going to give dudes that, that official stamp. You know, this man is officially stamped. He's been stamped. You know, it's not like we had to stamp him. He was already stamped. But yep. just to show our love, we're going to give him that stamp. That's yeah. facts, bro. It's been a long time coming, stamp. man. Yes, we want to give credit where credit's due. Yes, we do. You know, a lot of people only really give credit where credit's due. Like, this shit really start with the player. So, like, yep. we got to tell the real story. Yep. So, yo, Dex, like, what's the first question you want to ask him, bro? Yeah, he, you know, he, he said he said he repped the Bronx. You know, he repped the Bronx. Uh, nah. You know, yo, you been saying all week, bro. All these calls. Yep. Yep. So, like I said, the, the 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 big thing to me is you talking about the legends question. Legends question. Oh, you want to start? You want to start off with that one? We got to start with the smoke. <laughs> we not you start off with that one. Start with that shit. Ooh, start so with that. The big thing that we've been discussing is you have a lot of guys saying that they are street ball legends. They're legends, they're icons. Mm -hmm. So our question that we want to pose to everybody that come on the show is, what is your definition of a legend? What's the criteria? You know, what is there a committee that uh, this secret committee that we don't know about that say, oh, you a legend? Or, you know, we're not talking hood famous. We're talking internationally known legend. Basketball. Yeah, basketball, basketball. street ball. And my Playground, thing is, my thing is, Playground, street ball. Legend. Yes. Like, I mean, is, like is, is, is it Kirk and Joe Hamm? Exactly. Is it how many chips you like won? Is it how many chips you won? Is it how many, exactly. chips, you won? Is it how many courts you dominated? Exactly. Is it, you know, what, what what do you think make a legend? Um, First of all, you 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 can't make a legend. A legend of there somebody, you so you can't name yourself. You can't call there yourself you a legend. There you go. You, um... You got you to gotta put in a lot of pain when it comes to this um, street ball and basketball. Yep. And, and you, 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 can't, you, got, you can't be a neighborhood, right? You there gotta, you go. Because there's different, le there's different um, legends, right? You yeah. got a neighborhood legend. Yeah. You got that park legend that's, that just plays in that one park. He don't go nowhere else, and he, and he calls himself a legend. So the word legend be misscrewed. Mis so you got legends. You got um, entertainers. Yep. You got showmen. Yep. So, mm -hmm. I mean... To be a, a official street ball legend, um, honestly, you have to um, somebody, somebody have to say you you have to have some type of pro level experience to be able to say you know what he could have been in the league or right. he could have had a shot to be a pro. But other than that, um, it's too many legends. Dex was just right when we talk about street yep. ball, it's too many legends. Too many self proclaimed legends. Yeah. Let's say that. Yep. Yeah, I mean. A legend, right? So for me personally, 
I don't even, I didn't think I was a legend until a legend called me a legend. Exactly. Right? So meaning when when I had guys like Pee Wee Kirkland and, and Joe Hammett, who's I, um, um, but, which, uh, from New York, possibly one of the top legends in, in, mm-hmm. in street boy history, when they come up to me and tell me, you know what, that you're going to be a legend one day and you're a legend, that's, that's when you get that's stamped. From. So you got to yep. get stamped. From 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 and not just them from other people. So I mean I don't know, yeah. man. There's it's a lot of legends out here, but ain't putting no legendary work. Yeah, because to me it, it's a lot of things that are going to be a legend. I mean, I, it, wait, it, wait, wait. I'll tell you who's not a legend. I tell you what's not a legend. Okay, tell me. If you was on that and one mixtape tour and you went around city to city and you that's all you did, Mm-mm. you ain't a legend. Nah. Mm-mm. Bottom line, I agree. I don't care if you was on the cover of Sports Illustrated. You ain't Uh-oh. a legend. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I agree. Uh-oh. <laughs> That's shots. Like but, but now, I ain't shots. is the truth. I mean, I, I, me, I, you know, I'm saying is it, like you said, you think you have to really do your thing in different parks. and di- So I, I, is it the amount of chips you win? Is it if you dominate? Like you said, you can't, I don't think you can play in one park and call yourself a right. legend. No, you got to dom. You have to, you have, you fig- it's not about playing. You have to dominate. Right, so legends they they dominate when they leave the park. There's a story to be told, right? Yep. So it's, yep. and it's it's not the same park. They go to. I'm from New York, so you got to play in Brooklyn, you got to play in Queens. Hello, you got to play in Harlem. You got to play in Bronx. You got to you got to take outside that. and and we all know if you live in New York, Brooklyn is one of the is 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 yeah. it. So if you ain't kind of put it on out in Brooklyn alone. You, you ain't really got no status out there, you know? So that word legend is, like I say, to me, it's different because um, Joe Hamm and Pee Wee Kirkland, to me, like, when the NBA, the NBA was calling guys like that. So, you know, colleges, so I don't know, man. If you ain't play high school ball, you ain't, I mean, some legends didn't, but they know they could have, but I don't know. Just tell me, you tell me who you think is a legend. I'll tell you if they is or not. Since we want to put people, since we want to, no, since we want you give me some names, and I tell you as who you think is a legend, I'll tell you if they are they not, in my opinion. So before we get there, right, let's let's get into your story, mm-hmm. right? Shane the Dribble Machine, you from Bronx, New York, right? You said a legend stamped you. Born and raised yep. in Harlem, yes. At what point did that legend stamp, like, stamp you? Where were you at? So I played, I, I played, um... Street ball since 15, 16 years old. Mm-hmm. So um, that right there alone is tough coming coming from New York City playing in the Rucker. Again, like I, when, I, when I first stepped on the scene and walked in the park, Steve Burke was playing. And, and, and if you know who Steve Burke legend. is, yep. that's a legend. That's a legend. You know what I mean? and, it, and, yep. he, and he was taking a break off of playing in the pros. You know, yep. I had guys like Richie Adams, Walter Berry, you know what I'm saying? Like, yep. um, those are legends. I mean, when I mean legends, I'm talking about legends. So just just to be able to play amongst those guys and to be accepted from 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 to all the way to 33 years old, 34 years old, mm-hmm. right? To keep playing and playing every park, every park, every playground, and play against the best and compete. Yep. And I mean, if we talk about winning, um, I haven't won a rucker, but I. I probably got the most wins in, in Dykeman. I've won probably every other tournament three or four times. Um, n- never, never not, never not played in an All Star game in a tournament. Um, when they was talking about MVP trophies, at um, what people don't know, but at fourteen, fifteen, I was getting fifty points in the games. So I don't, I don't know. So it's different. And one, one of the best backcourts I ever seen in street ball was you and Skip. There, me, there was, That's a problem right there. Oh, me my and Sk- God. <laughs> what, I, mean, a I mean, I play, I play with teams. Yeah, yeah, me and Future yeah. was crazy. But yeah. Future, me and Future, Future, Future but me and Tyson, Team Tyson, just imagine this Team Tyson backcourt. Me, Skip, and Ali Mo. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. 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 That's the day, man. Oh, my God. R.I.P. R.I.P. to Ali Mo. Oh, my God. Al is a legend. Certified. Me, Skip, and Ali Mo. That's crazy. You know what I'm saying? That's crazy. One, two, and three. I play, I play with Tommy Hill figures. It was me and Sham Guard. That's crazy. Yeah, that's crazy. You and Sham. Another legend. You know what I'm saying? Mousy right Dream Another. Team. Me, Kareem Reed, Future. Another one. Right? Yep. So, 
So all of, these are legendary Already, <laughs> le- legends of legends. So, I feel like you got to give Mousy his credit, too, because he was always there. He always It's always somebody under him, you know what I mean? He always got a team somewhere making yeah, some type of noise. There's definitely, definitely. It's, it's the backstory that you don't know about. That. What's, what's that? About, like, guys, like, even, like, how Mousy wasn't the... Is Lenard, is right? So a guy named Lenard. If you know about Lenard was the first guy to bring out young guys like Future and them before mm-hmm. me, right? Um it was called the Future Pros. Yep. He brought out all the young guns, all the young best players from Carton Hines. So God was there. He passed away and left the team to Mousy. Okay. So Mousy picked up from there and it went from the Future Pros, but you can't keep the name Future Pros because that's Lenard. Right? Yeah. So they just right. changed it to Mousy Dream Team. And, and believe it or not, um, our backcourt Future had a lot to do with that too, um, putting that putting that together. But that's my other, my other backcourt partner. Where it really got legendary future. was me and Future. Future gave me my name. Yeah. Yeah. How? Run and shoot. Yeah, Atlanta. Ago, first time yeah. I met him. Remember, I used to tell you this story all the time. Um, first time I met Future, Prime, it was Future Prime. Oh, I think that's the first time I met Al. Maine. That's when Future and Sauce played against each other the first time, and Future had like fifty. It's not a basketball game. Was... <laughs> nah, he killed. Nah, Future. That's what I mean about legend, right? No, this was the source of my guy. That's what I mean. Like, oh, we le- legend and entertainment. Entertainment. Ent- ent- entertainment. Yep. 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 I, I agree. I mean, but, I, but, 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 no, sauce. no, wait, 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 because since we're here, you've been telling me about this G- sauce that nobody's ever seen, Roz. Exactly. Yo, sauce used to come down and dunk on Yo, people. he said sauce, sauce was dunking. Do- Listen, when I first met sauce, I was 12 years old, okay, at run and shoot. <laughs> <laughs> Travis, I got to hear this, bro. He said Travis, sauce was listen, banging. Travis, yeah, Travis Best it. would come in there, guard sauce. And before when I when I seen Sauce, he's shooting on the goals with the kids and stuff, getting shots up, throwing Travis it off Best the glass. Best game, my man, seventy nine, but guy. Yeah, uh, that's all right. So, <laughs> and run and shoot, you had that's to play right. on two nah. courts. Yep. If you if you if you from Atlanta and you hoop, run and shoot, court one and court four. Those are the only courts you play on. Mm-hmm. Sauce was waiting to get on court four. Travis Best. How old was in. Sauce about this time? Twenty-something, I think. And you were still 13? 13. Word. When I first met him. And man, so sauce. sauce is that much older than you. Yeah. So word is born? Word is born. So mm. he know. Yeah. <laughs> he know. <laughs> I, that's that's so, an age gap. <laughs> so so my thing is too, is it anybody that you would consider an icon, a street ball icon? Like so we, uh, it's Above goat. Legend. The goats. It is the, the goats. goats. So, yeah. Like that's why we were talking about that. Yeah. After, it's so many legends, right? The, the real legends start pushing themselves over to the goats. So the goats yeah. are all the guys that I named: the Joe Hammonds, the mm-hmm. uh, the Pee Wee Kirklands, the uh, helicopters. Those those are the goats. Of Man the goat. Right. Goats. Those the yep. era, era, especially era, era Man goats. Yeah. Real goats. So those yeah. again, but like I said, even. Those are the guys who who who, who stamped me, meaning who mm-hmm. who came to me and, and took a liking to me and and I, and, and the tutelage of teaching me. Uh, quick question: um, um, Joe Hammond told me that Michael Jordan wasn't all of that, <laughs> <laughs> right? So check it out. So Kirkus. so this is, and I'm looking at him like, yeah, you tripping, the Joe. No, you be, no, you had a bag of that old boy now, but, but, but yo, you had that good. Well, you must have. So, 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 yo. so, 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 I'm listening to it. I'm like, I'm listening to it, but in my mind, I'm saying, because that's, yeah, that's I'm saying he's a hater, right? I'm, mm-hmm. keep it real. I'm saying he's a hater, you know, yep. like Mike. So, but as he's talking to me, the conversation is, it's starting to make sense of what he's saying to me. Break that down, right? He's saying, yo, back when I played, you can't take 30 shots. If somebody took 30 shots in one game, one player, you know what would happen to him? <laughs> so I'm like, 
Damn, that's kind of right, though, right? Then, then he broke down shooter percentages, right? He broke, mm-hmm. Then yeah. he broke down f- free throw percentages. So once he broke down shooter percentage and free throw percentage, then it, it started making sense to where um, I took that with me training and teaching and coaching. I'd use the same logic that I, I, I tell kids the exact same thing that Joe Hammond says. You know, like, like yo, like, why would you take, who wants to play somebody to take 35 shots in a game? Right, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. So, yeah. so it kind of made a sense. Like, not say I still ain't believing Mike is still the guy, but yeah. but it started. It did. It makes sense saying like, um, so if you shot, think about this, if you shot nine for eighteen from three point range in the NBA, that's great, right? Real great. Yeah, that's great. That's fifty percent. You that's definitely great. got a job. Yep. If you shot nine from eighteen from the free throw line, that's what horrible. Fifty percent. That's horrible. Gibbs. Yeah. So now when two Joe, different shots. Yeah. So now when Joe yeah. Joe's breaking the game to me, so this how he broke it to me. If you played on my team and you shot nine for eighteen threes, fam, you miss too many than you made. Way too many. Yeah. You miss nine shots. So I see what you mean. The game is different, and that's when it goes to that generational thing. Like the, well, the, the game keep elevating. Because well, back in the days, you looked at shot percentage. It's, it's, Today's game, you look at the total points, yeah, bro. But they but they don't show. Okay, he scored 50, but he took 30-something yeah, shots. Niggas ain't even lifting weights no more, bro. It's all rubber band training. <laughs> like, bro, it's, I mean, it's a different game. I mean, like Joe said, it's, and just basketball, if you shoot 70% from the corner, where should most of your shots be at? You said if you shot 70% from and, the corner? And, and 50% from the top of the key, where do you think you should be at? Stay your ass in the corner. But, yeah. but today's basketball... They not stand in the corner. No, they on the wing. The no. They on the top of the key. You know what I'm yeah. saying? So it's, it's yeah. different now. Well, yeah. They want seven two dudes shooting forty footers. Like yo, the whole yeah. game is different. Yeah, man. I yeah, like this man. game better, but guys. What, yeah, street yeah. ball. It has its own language. It does, man. It does. You know how we used to talk bop bop. I hit him with the bop bop. It's like only we know what that means. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Or hoopers. You know. Well, I mean, you know, and two, I remember when they said that street ball was killing. Fundamental basketball, but if you look at the game today, they, they, they e, 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 ESP, ESPN, then, all you but, see is highlights. Oh, that's an M one move. Yeah, it's glorified. They can't play it. basketball without they, saying M one. You, you can't. can't. Yeah, they can't say do they it. still say M one on the highlights. Oh, did you see that? Oh, and that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. It's so a culture, man. I mean, I look at it as this too. When you got a sham guard, right? Yeah, it came with the sham guard move. One of the highest, biggest names. But it didn't it didn't it didn't transfer over to the NBA to where what happened, right? He um for somehow I don't know what happened, but I don't know if he got cut, but he's not in the league. Fast forward thirty years, twenty years later, who's Co- teaching? Sham guard. Everybody. <laughs> right? So he's right, he's in de- and who's he teaching? One of the best, right? He's with, Everybody. He was yeah. with Luca, right? Luca. So, yep. so 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 again, it's it's, it's street ball. Yeah, facts. That's all right? it so yeah. what it is is it's the is is it's taking a chance and not being afraid and putting a bottle over it. Now that now that they see that they can't stop it, it, it it's open. It's just, I hate to say it, but it's it's like it's like weed, right? You it, everybody it's so much that you know what we we can't we can't stop you from smoking it, right? So guess what? We're gonna make it legal now. We're gonna make yeah. it legal. <laughs> Tax that shit. And we're gonna make money off. And we're gonna make money off of it, off yeah. of it right? Yeah. It's the same thing with Sham was saying. Yeah. Yeah. So. I mean, I, yeah. I got a question, man. What do you think your game, what you bought? You know, we talk about N1 changed the culture. Like, N1 was a society. Like, we, it impacted society. That's what y'all did. What did your game do as Shane the Dribble Machine to impact the culture today? I mean, for, with N1 or just... They, they, In general. Just your game. Bro, you, you, you one of the founding fathers, bro. Yeah, but you was there. But, but again, if we going... If it was with N1, it's... I, I, like I tell everybody... Um, you ain't see me with N one. You ain't you ain't see me play. You see me you see me make passes. You didn't see Shane the dribble machine. You seen a thirty a, a thirty two year old guy uh, that that was that was so good, right? That was that was good enough to still play with the younger guys. To that was survival. So so, but now what you talk about? What I brought was I brought um leadership. Yeah. Okay. Right. Um. A vocal. What I brought is, is teaching how to be vocal leadership. And, um, well, like he listening. Like and, yo, and, yo. Know, yo. And, sa- and sacrifice. Right. I, I've, I've, I've sacrificed the game. Knowing which I again, what I teach the kids um now is, the best player on the team is the guy that's open. Facts. 
You know what I mean? So, yeah. so what I what I what I bring is 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 toughness, right? Toughness and and teamwork. Yeah. You sound like an unselfish dude. Do you think you were selfish back then, or do you feel like like, <laughs> you know what I mean? And when I say like selfish back then, I'm not asking like you personally. Like, I'm saying like bring it to the game. I mean. No, nah, I, I feel I was, uh, uh, that's my character. So who, who you are on the court is who you are off the court, mm -hmm. uh, especially if you play ball. So if you go by everybody that play and one, look at them on the, on the basketball court, and they're the same, they the same person off the court. Mm -hmm. So if you're an asshole on the court, you're an asshole <laughs> off the court. Uh, yeah, you pretty look much. At, it's you, true. You, pretty you, much. You, uh, well, I, I play, I'm going to joke around, right, and I'm going to do that off the court. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So, yeah. and that's how it is. Your pers your personality, um, whatever you love, whatever you do, whatever you love, your personality is always gonna spill over to it because you love it. So when you love it, you're giving it your all. Bro, so, why people yeah. don't get that? Yeah, yeah bro, man. when you love something, like bro, it's not a job no more. Yep, you find something you love and make a career out of it. That's Period. what they said. That's what they said, man. When it's when you love it, man, it's not even something that you think about getting paid for. Right. Facts. You and know, one. You, that's your craft, the love, the, the, the money and all that's going to come. That's how that's, it's that's, going to come. That's what and one come. did. They took a yep. they took advantage of the love of the game. Yeah. They could have been. <laughs> nah, real, yeah. nah, when you look at who it was started from and you look back like, yeah, they took advantage of the they game. They took advantage of the love of the game. They like, knew exactly yeah. what they did. They monetized um, off that shit. And, and, and even with them is they... They, they, people say they robbed us, but they kind of robbed themselves when I look at it. You know why? Because they could have robbed, they didn't, believe it or not, they never, have, they, for um, when it first started, how it came, they didn't have to give us no money. Because you was doing it for the love. Would you have done it. that shit if they said, I come out here and play for free? For, wait, wait, so, um. <laughs> it's the clothes. And one used to send boxes sneakers, on boxes sneakers, on boxes. Sneakers clothes, sneakers clothes, but. I would have did it. You know why? It's the re we just finished talking about that. It's the recognition that comes with it. Notoriety, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? So yep. the money yep. back then, uh, I was getting we, we was getting paid to play street ball on on an, on an, another note. Well, we just we was just talking about this. Right? Right? We were so talking we about back paid. in the days. Right? Yeah, so I was man. getting paid already. Yeah. yeah. So that right there is just a stamp of you know what? Of uh, that's like saying, um, yo, yo, these they, these dudes is coming from Brooklyn with they five. You're not gonna have your father to play against them. Yeah, I'm gonna absolutely. be ready. So when when they said that and they say we're going out to Jersey, or long as they long as they get us there, they we was good. Yeah. I mean, the first five, eventually we would have called on probably later, but nah. And it was, I think too, like you said, it wasn't about the money. It was more about pride too. Like we yeah. bust their ass. Yeah, we, we went to Brooklyn and pfft, yo. We was city, doing that city. anyway, yeah. right? So I exactly. mean, playing playing with um. Playing for Rucker, I was doing it anyway, regardless of the day, Greg Marius. Yep. He would grab me in future and take us to Virginia. Yep. People don't know, and play against Allen Iverson before he's out before he was um Allen Iverson and, and take us over here to go play over here. Yep. Or um we come from New York, a drug dealer may say, Listen, yo, we got a game in Paris in New Jersey. Like yep. I mean, you know what I mean? We going over there to play over here. So that was it wasn't about the money at times, right? So you got older because People lie and say they got paid. They lie. They didn't get paid all the time. I didn't get paid the street ball until I was in my 20s. Yep. People lie. I was playing. Yep. Mm -hmm. When I found out that you could get paid an amount, <laughs> like, mm. um, I, I, I kind of jumped ship from my home team hey. because my home team is the home team. That's love. And I, they're not going to give me no money. Yep. So now it's like, yo, um, I like to tell my I, first time I remember, I, I told my boy I was out of game. My man came up, the dude came up to me was like, yo, what's up, what you doing? I'm like, yo, I'm about to play this game. It's about to be the playoff game. He go, word, damn. You want to play me in Jersey? I don't even know him. I'm like, nah. He like, yo, I got 500 for you. <laughs> well, I'm there, nigga. I'm, I'm leaving. I'm there. I told my man, like, yo. <laughs> love is love. I got money go. over there. So, but you better give me 500 to play a jersey. Yep. Look, I told my man. You know what my man said? What? Yo, we out. <laughs> <laughs> Word. I'm telling you, fuck it. And then, and then, and once that happened, I was like, oh, so this, this is how it works. And yep. I I just walked, me, I just walked to a neighbor tournament. And then it'd be like, yo, so who you playing with? You, yo, 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 how much you got for me? And they throw the number out there. And that yep. was it. That was... 
So you went on tour, bro. What was the first place you went when y'all like went outside of New York? What was the first place you went that like first really city we... changed your life? Yeah. So it was like I do this shit for a living now. That's O two. Now I mean just the tour period. So I think doing it for a living is when it started with the first six guys. Meaning jumping in the van, going city to city, going to Chicago. I, mean, I ain't never been to Chicago. Yep. Going to these like forget overseas, but the first couple of cities. Now, unless we played college ball, but that most, again, college ball was 10, 15 years behind us. So, yeah. so that was like just just doing that right there. It was like, wow, we kind of, you know what I mean? Like we doing something. Yeah. So talking about the tour, who was, you know, guys on the tour that that you clicked up with? Who, who was your people? In, and was it anybody on the tour that you didn't get along with? Y'all might be cool now, but... You know, I wasn't I, fucking with that nigga. Was it dudes who was nah, cool nah, with it? Dudes who yeah, yeah. wasn't no, really. Uh, no, what it is is I, we came in, we came in, and left with the same people. So yeah. Yeah. I never really kind of clicked on the people. I I just met people like okay. like yeah. like Roz. I didn't click on the Roz. I met Roz. We became cool. Right. Put it this way. If you was on our tour bus, you was clicked in. Facts. You was, you was crew, you was team. You, you was team. Yeah. I, was, I was on the tour bus. Yeah. I slept right above Flash, God rest the day. And and, and, and you was team, and and, 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 and Roz know what and Roz know what their job was on the tour bus. That's it. What was, what was your job? <laughs> Just going to the back with y'all and, and what, what was your job, though? What? Roll up. Roll up. <laughs> <laughs> yo, Shane's like, yo, ro matter of fact, that real was, quick. Hey, hey, what, what's the move when Benny Siegel told your man, roll up? Yeah, yeah. roll up. That's real, all you got to do. Roll real up. Real quick, real quick, real quick. Let's jump ship. Went to the back of the bus. I'm rolling up. 50 walk back there. Shane and Maine back there. <laughs> Shane said, roll up, Rise. I'm rolling up. 50 don't smoke. 50 don't like the smell of smoke. Nothing. He gamble. 50 went in the back, Shane did something because it was a way on the tour bus we could lock the door. Can't nobody get out. Lock 50 in the room. I had one. Shane had one. Main had one. 50 just ended. <laughs> High as a kite. <laughs> All the doors closed, everything. <laughs> let, let him out, Shane. Nah. <laughs> so he getting contact. Yeah, Straight yeah. Straight contact. <laughs> and so it was it was all. 50 it was stayed a on pleasure. the bus the whole joint. The bro. whole joint. He stayed with us. Cause he was on the what we had the production bus, smokers bus, savage bus. That's, That's why dope. that nigga stayed there. And another yeah, we bus. We was the Rikers Island bus. <laughs> Your word is born. Do whatever. Yeah, you go on our bus, yo. You, it's Dutch gutches all through the whole on the floor, <laughs> right? Beer the bottles. Was, How the hell was y'all playing every night? So, hey, for the so now, game. so, so here's the here's the interesting story yeah. about that. Not real talk, cause I, cause I'm gonna talk about that. But here's the interesting talk, story about that. Like I tell people is. Let me see. Where and one started? Where, where and one started? The which one? Like the, the beginning, real, the first the game. What, what, what was that? The Jersey. Ninety nine. Oh my! Oh, oh Jersey, the Jersey game. The limo came. Yeah. No. Ninety nine. Ninety nine. Oh, the first, the first one. 99. So ninety nine. Me, main half, Air aircraft. Game. But me, main half. My bad. It's sensitive. Me, main half, <laughs> aircraft. I we I we used to cheat. So we started chiefing in the limo before that game. People don't know about the tour, but they gotta they gotta know, man. They gotta know the fans know. But we never not chief throughout the whole tour. Shit, yeah. I wouldn't even. Have no, 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 no. You don't understand what I'm saying. Oh. I'm, I'm talking about Y'all Ron our testing it? The listen, like like NBA P no, listen. Chief on the way to the game, right? Chief at the game. Yeah, no cap. Chief on our way to open run. Like we had buses, right? So we're we're chief, boom, boom. Okay, Ben. All right, we're gonna hit the HMF, but we're gonna hit this this bus. All the fans is there, we chiefing. We just finished chiefing. <laughs> chiefing. Get out the bus, go to open run. No lie, we used to get out and everybody used to be like, yo, this is crazy, yo. They, they got to know we hot. Yo, that's, what, <laughs> hey, yo, that's, what we should, that's what we used to be saying. So they got to know, yo. They got to know. But, but but nobody got, but we get an open run. I guess it brought out the personality. That's why you've seen everybody always, yo, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was the game. So now we in an open run, right? Open run, the game at seven. Open run, after open run, all the players go in, they change. 
We go chief. At the, on the bus. We go right back on the bus. We go chief. And then we blow. And then we, yo, we, and then the, the problem is, is what make, what make the tour great about us is honestly, I tell the people, it's like, I don't know how we did. I don't know how we was winning. That's why y'all still busting niggas ass. Like, yo. Yo, I'll tell you a story. We went to D.C. to play against some D.C. guys. All right. Barry Forbes? Somewhere in D.C. But again, we used to smoke from New York. <laughs> if we played in South Carolina, we smoked from New York all the way to Word. game day. So I'm talking <laughs> about in the car all the way till we get ready to play the game. Yeah, Al. That's what I'm, y'all understand, bro. That's what I'm saying. You like, was busy, Riser. Like... <laughs> <laughs> like a roll like, up me, little nigga. <laughs> yo, like let, let me let me okay. just give you a, a pure example, right? So we so we play in DC, we highs a kite. They got us 33 to like four. No the cap. crowd right. is booing us. Yeah, sober that fucker. Yeah, sober the fuck they up. Bugging out. Oh, fake air one. We knew that was a gimmick. We just bugging. We just like, yo. Gonna shake it off, y'all. So we we were getting a timeout, and we have a saying in our timeout. Yeah. And then we say our saying. The next you know we. What was the saying? We gonna get in here. We gonna smoke. We gonna smoke they weed. <laughs> we gonna bust they ass. And we gonna and we and we gonna fuck they bitches and we gonna yeah. get the body. <laughs> Straight up. No lie. Straight up. <laughs> no lie. And at the end of the game, you know what happened? We up 30. All the above. We up 30. And they like, oh my God, yo, you the oh. So that honestly, so that's what Aaron Warren brought um differently. The word groupie. I, we always we always had that playing basketball athlete or just if you just handsome, right? You got girls that like you, but Aaron Warren brought a, that's what that brought that was different. Like just from city to city, you know, it was we we was love, but like girls chasing down a tour bus, falling falling in the street, meeting like, you in the next city, like I autograph session. Uh, you got a dude <laughs> with this girl, and she like, can you sign this? And you like, yeah, and she pull a titty out. You like, yo, money, you like, <laughs> like, like, are you sure? <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, That's crazy. so 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 I'm so on. That's what the tour, like me, 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 I, cause this is almost the next ask question. Three words to describe the and one mixtape tour. <laughs> That's what I want y'all to keep that in your I was high. No, three I want you to I want y'all to ask people that. Just give them three words to describe the tour. Three words. That's it, three words. That's a good. I wanna do that. In order. Not right, so it gotta be in order. So in order it was weed, one. I'm writing this shit down. Groupies, two. I hate to say it like that. You know what was last? What? Basketball. That makes sense. No cap. She was last. No cap. That was, that was. But the thing about it too is, like you said, a lot of people thought it was gimmicks, but we were just talking about that, that everybody on that team could play. Yeah, everybody. Yeah, so everybody that, could get so busy. That, that first crew, everybody on the, the team first could crew play. was, I mean, was all Division One players. Everybody except could if play. you ain't, unless, you know, like, even with Headache Me, Headache, like that first <sighs> that first call with me, Headache Future, Half Man, yeah. Main, yeah. Everybody could play. Yo, that yo, that was a dynasty. People don't yep. understand that yep. team. It's still living we, today. And and reason why, because every, forget that. It's not the point everybody could play. What's missing in today's street ball and just game is everybody knew they roll. Exactly. Everybody knew. We knew half was going to grab every, every rebound. rebound. Everybody. Right? And we'll beat you down the right? we, I knew. Yep. I knew aircraft going to block everything. Right. I knew once half grabbed the rebound, I already knew. Just Maine is already, he's already taking flight. But I already knew Future's over there ready to shoot the jumper. So the chemistry was so good. That's I think that's what made us good because the chemistry was so good. And we all played with each other for many years before that. Yep. We was doing tours before there was a tour. Mm -hmm. yep. yep. So basically the rucker before, before everything blew. Because that's where y'all was playing at, yeah, right? Rock, yeah, yeah, yeah. The yep. rucker, there was just new. I don't want to give, see, we, we, 
Rucker is it was the biggest name tournament, but at them other little tournaments a lot we, of little tournaments. that we yeah. don't talk about, yeah. those kind of prepared us Soul just as much hole, be, because uh, Rucker Kingdom because yeah. Rucker yeah. Rucker was 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 a platform where you got to come and show out. For me, like for me with Rucker, I had to only play one way. You understand what I'm saying? Like if I played in Rucker, they don't want to see me come play like I'm playing at Westchester Community College. No. They want to see me come down and dance, and they so so Rucker was like that. So other tournaments, they they they, they wasn't big that they didn't they didn't have an announcer, they yep. didn't have all of that. So guess what? You can do all that you want, ain't nobody saying nothing. Yep. So you guess what? You got to save that for Rucker. You got to play your real game. You got to yep. just play ball. So so it's all the tournament. It's just that Rucker kind of highlighted everything, right? Because it's nice. the main stage. Yep. As once you make it, it was the, the entertainment stage right there. Yep. So. One question I had about the tour, because I was talking to uh, one of the NBA guys that was signed to N1 back in the days. And <laughs> he was saying that I think they did a commercial shoot, and he said he felt that it was some beef between the mixtape dudes and the NBA dudes. Yeah, and, I like them. And, and my, my, my whole comeback was... Who? When when we all started playing I mean, ball, we don't do the who he. No, no, we don't do. <laughs> when, we, we don't do the who he. When we all, when we all, we drop that. Okay, no, I'll tell you. I'll tell, tell you. Name. Ben Wallace. Oh, Ben Wallace, Hall oh. of Famer. But he was just saying, but Ben, he, it wasn't no beef. He was just like, no, hey, no, man. no, no, no. He was no, like, he was no, like, no, I'm I don't glad know. You said that. No, like, I don't know why them dudes like me. No, I'm saying why. I'm glad you said. You know why? Ben came late in the game. Yeah. And Ben Williams, we wasn't thinking. We never. Ben never, I, I got a picture with Ben and yeah. the crew. I got Ben and the crew. But Detroit did y'all Pistons. still not fuck with him? I got them weed in the club. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's how you know a nigga fuck with you, bro. Yeah. What no, you he, talking about? He was just saying, it wasn't no beef. He just it said, yo. Nothing. He said, I felt like they was mad at nah, me for some no, reason. Like, no, no, like, I'm going to tell you what the NBA was mad at. Mm -hmm. The same, how I got them to, I the weed in the club. We in, the, we in um, Florida. Detroit Pistons won two back-to-back -back Championships, Ben Wallace. Remember they won back to back. We out there. It's not even an air one event. We out there, but I'm out there. Main event. Have we just street ball? But we were air one, so everybody know who he is. We go in the club. The club go crazy. Oh my God, air one the building. I see my God Chauncey. I'm like, hey yo, Chauncey build up. I see all of them. Um, Chuck Act. Those are my guys. Yeah. So I see them. I'm like, oh my God. Yo, what up, chilling? I go to the DJ. I'm like, yo. Chauncey Billups, Ben Wiles, yo, yo, shout them out, they in here. The DJ looked at me and said, man, fuck them, man, y'all, y'all the man. <laughs> Two times. Hey. Yeah. We going, we, we, we going to a club in Atlanta. <laughs> we going to a club in Atlanta. We walking to the club. Um, God bless the dead um, from Philly, NBA, NBA um, that just passed. Could be a, oh, Rasul. Rasul. Yeah. Rasul Butler. Rasul with us. We yeah. walking in the club. We going in the club in Atlanta. He got he's the NBA guy. Yep. We walking in. We, we, we there's a line. Everybody mad because then they see oh that's an one. Somebody yells out. Look at the NBA guy trying to hang with the an one dude. <laughs> it ain't us. Like yep. the, the the people the people that we go to Chicago. We on tour. They say yo listen, yo not even Michael Jordan came and did what y'all did. So yep. I think I think we we out. They thought we was jealous. It wasn't that we was we never was jealous of no NBA player because honestly, we the people we was the people share. Yeah, because my the, the NBA player what they did what they didn't realize was, and what I think what the brand the brand did wrong was trying to separate the two. Yeah, they should have put us to, they should have put us together in a commercial and let us and, and pump a pump pump a Ben Wallace shoe. Yeah, because they because I last time I checked. I don't know one NBA player that's so uh, and one shoe. Chauncey, the rise. What well, is that? That's not his though. It's not his. It's yeah, not his. like there's no, 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 nobody, no, only one, only one ever had their he own shoe. Was Steph, Marbury was the only one had his own shoe and it made it Man, popular. Right. So he was the only one. So so yeah. so. But two, you gotta understand the appeal of Steph was. Steph used to get busy street ball wise. He used to exactly. come play at Rucker. So, he used to come exactly. play. Marbury ain't no joke. <laughs> so so, so shout the, out to Coney Island. So yep. so was, that's where they messed. That's where. So like we never had no kind of kind of beef with because we hung with most of. It's it probably probably even on tour. But Larry probably Hughes, some of the guys that probably chocolate. that probably thought they was bigger than them. But I never I never that not this the first time I heard about them. Oh, they probably heard the um the name given. 
probably that when What's the name? when when Kenny when Kenny Smith gonna call Vince Carter half man knowing yeah. damn well that was, was another it, yeah you know Biz, I mean? Biz, Biz was already there so yeah, maybe Biz maybe already had that that's where maybe from there because what we what we started seeing was these guys going on TNT. Yeah. And they giving guys street ball names, not not NBA names. They giving the guys the names of people that's, that's already still playing. Yeah, Man. you know what yeah. I'm saying. So it was like, and, and even the saying, they they took it and they went over there. That's what that's yeah. why TNT, That's why Kenny is dope because he's using come. He, he brought the air one flavor. Yeah, because I, I what I couldn't understand, and I, I you know I was saying that, you know for whatever reason when when everybody ball players when you start playing your dream is to make it to the league that's the now for whatever goal. reason you don't make it to the goal. league it is what it is that's but my my whole thing was you know that if y'all was on tour anywhere in the, anywhere in the world and Shane got a call from yo this is New York Knicks we need you to come fill out this roster there. spot you what out. you gonna do I'm out. <laughs> that's any. That's any. Out of there. Yeah. That's that. That's why. I mean. That's keeping it real. Because yeah, that's any. Because a lot of guys mm-hmm. were saying that. But you know, if you you play street ball and you went to the league, like your street ball pass is revoked. I'm like, but nah. but 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 street ball. Let's let's let's. Well, let's, let's, some 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 no, 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 NBA no, no, guys. Let's separate this. Let's separate oh, this. Definitely. Let's let's do this. Let's stop saying and one and street ball together. That's yes. hard, bro. It, it, it's not really hard because it's not. That's a New York City thing. What's a New York City thing? Like when, like people separate that, like basketball here, Chicago, no, like in no. certain places. So they no, do that. I'm, but I'm trying to tell you, and one, us. Period. It was we had street, we had players that play street ball, but it but wasn't just as a whole. Nah, it, it wasn't, wasn't just street, street ball. ball. It yes. wasn't. You know why? Because they took the elements out of it once we got in the arenas. Yep, right, yep, right. Yep. They, they, they took element out of it once. Once the referees can't make calls, right. So yep. if you get fouled, you're supposed to get go to, go shoot the free throw. Yep. So once you start bending the rules, once you take the rules out, it's no longer entertainment. Yeah, it becomes en- entertainment. Yep. and and we got confused it because, again, like he like Dex said, you got six people that were stamped. Yep. And no, and and it was our fault because we stamped it. In the beginning, we stamped it because we was going on a street ball path. It was real ball. It was di- and then once Sauce came to that, the street ball it started going commercial, and that's when the street ball started coming out of it. That's when yep. we started seeing the the other stuff coming out of it, and it, and and it watered it ain't watered it down, but it, be- it became a business then. Well, because me even today. When I'm looking to sign players, I always tell Dave, I look at a player not that he could just play in the league, that but if I, could, if I could put him any park in America, could he get busy? That right. mentality. That's how I look at players. Because I, I, I don't want a dude who, you know, okay, he get busy in the NBA arenas, but if you put him in the park with dudes, and because New York was a different beast, and I tell us to dudes all the time where – NBA players can go to other cities, Chicago, what, different places, and they'll be like, oh, that's such and such. Oh, New York? Yeah. Like at Rucker? When y'all saw NBA player, y'all oh, mindset was, oh, I up. Woo, wait. we about, about to make get my it. name off your ass. We about Div- to get Division it. Division one, any, can, I, I was like, about to get it. I mean, I, I watched my guy give Jason Richardson 35, right? Half man. Yeah. You know I mean, like, really, like, yeah. really, really, really go at him, like, Go out and um, me and Future, um, we beat Ray Allen. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. So, so it, it, it's you got but, footage of that? Nah, I wish. Ooh. But, 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 but <clears throat> again, the, the reason why is because I, it's some guys can't play on that atmosphere. Nope, right? that mentality not there. Nope, bro. and and that that the street. It's tough though. That's a that's totally street. different game. It is. That's a it's different the, game at that level, man. It's, it's so it it's the game, but it's game, but believe it or not, it's more atmosphere. Or something. It is. That like, too. Me, me growing up as a young kid in Brooklyn on the free throw line, um, you are you're in Brooklyn, and somebody yelling, "Yo, yo, get and make these two free throws." That's pressure. Yeah. Like, yeah. like, cause like it's a not lot playing of, either. It's a lot of pressure. Like I told you, I, um, I come from the era. I'm on the free throw line. And guys is betting ten thousand, ten thousand that you make the free throw. There you go. Right. I, mean, I told. I mean, I told you earlier. And back then, 
it was Alpo. God bless the day. It was Alpo yeah. and OG Wan. Yeah. You know what I mean? So like, I'm I'm around when that strip atmosphere. When you playing for these hustlers, and where I mean in my era, I'm no right. lie. I'm 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 glad to talk about it and made it through. But I really played with the notorious killers of New York. Yep. I've played I've played with them. I played for. I played in me and Future played in the basketball tournament and. Uh, I heard Fat Joe tell a story, and I heard Tyson Bedford tell the story about um, he played in the tournament and he almost got an altercation with a guy and Gaucho Jim and Tyson Bedford was like, yeah, I know he, he's, a, he's a thug, or, well, he's a model, he's supposed to be, yeah, man, them guys ain't know it was this and that. And I'm watching the interview and I'm like, yo, dude, I don't know who you know, but that was um, Future, Tyson Bradford put Future shorts down. We played the celebrity game, put the shorts down. So he hit Tyson Bradford ahead with the ball. He's a polo model. Yep. So he grabs he grabs it up. He kind of get frustrated. But I know Tyson Bradford probably would think he was a thug and all that. But God bless the dead. Um, Bio is used to um, from Zulu Nation. He got he, who's that? Like, was probably one of the was one of the top guns. Was ready to push the button. Like he kind of told us like it, like yo. Yo, yo, push him again. Like, really, basically, it's not really. I was like, we would play, like, push him again and then move out the way. Two. Yeah. Play a role. Hey, shout out to Willie Burgers, too. Yeah, you know what I mean? So, so <laughs> again, you like. you know, you know. So, like, like those eras of street ball, like, yeah. those are, but eras of street ball, people don't talk about, like, chasing the referees out the park. Yep. Yeah. Team, like, fights, um, getting into altercations of where, this particular group come come to your neighborhood with a five twenty cars deep. Yep. Right. So I've been on occasion yep. saying, "Yo, I want the guy. One of my guys did something to another guy, so they came back saying, listen, either give me, either give us twenty thousand or the guy who smacked me.' You said, mm-hmm. What? <laughs> so, so how many people got handed over? Yeah. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> How many people got handed over? Because I know everybody wasn't given twenty bags. Mm-hmm. I mean, but but just be imagine but, you know, that, just being scenario, in that situation yeah, where scenario. where they That's scary where yeah. right and, and you and you there and it's like from the beach, I remember man. I remember when I came here, I came to New York in '88. I'm originally from Texas. I came here on a basketball scholarship, and this kid that played on my team lived in Baisley, and he told me about the Sniff tournament mm-hmm. in Queens, where a lot of the big drug dealers they had teams, so. He's like, yo, I want you to come play with me in this tournament at Basie. But before I played, people was like, dude, I don't think you want to mess with that, dude. This, <laughs> this is what's going down there. Yes, and I was like, nah, I'm good on that, dog. Because when you got dudes betting 10, 20 bands on a game, dude, street ball game. New York, the one place you lose your life over I'm a like, game. I'm like, I already man, know. I'm Look, good on that, dude. Even on the tour, that, Boston, that, that first, yeah, when you used to- first trip oh. on the tour. First trip on the tour. I remember that's, that. We, first trip on the tour. First time we go on the Ashley type of tour. Yep. We, no security, right? When we got remember, and we didn't have no security. That's a Reggie Lewis Center, right? No, but we went to the park, Washington Park, right? That's another story. We out there that connects him. Some guy he comes out, <laughs> thugged out. Yo, y'all in my park? Woo, 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 woo. We just looking like, damn, we ain't got no security. Y'all right? That's first thing, right? We think. Next day, ask me, like, people tell you, next day, you know what we did? We went to Models. Oh, we, <laughs> oh, we bought bats. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, like That's but, that mentality, but, bro. We, we bought word. Different. We bought because the tour, I write the tour, at the beginning of the tour, like I tell anybody could have got a job. Yeah. You didn't have to have no experience. Mm-hmm. And you just, just you, 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 yeah, he went you, yeah, he need a job. Anybody gets, that's, we had somebody that, that was on tour. Uh, but anyway. <laughs> Chill out, yo. Chill out, yo. <laughs> no, no, because I be It's just th- episode one, dog. <laughs> <laughs> nah, no, 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 because no, I be thinking about it. Um, Even the Atlanta game, right? Like, look, who's the, look at the announcers on the tour. Go back. Go just back. Chill out, go back yo. on a videotape and look at it's the announcers. It's over now, Roz. It's over now, <laughs> bro. Just let up. <laughs> my man, oh, listen. You my, let. Yo, all my mans was the, my man was the announcer. Yeah. They yeah. had no experience. What was Duke? Huh? What was Duke? Duke. Duke. They came later. Duke was on, but Duke didn't come till after. Like, like, 
Oh three, oh three, oh four. So, so when that, this one, me personally, when they when when the Duke came on that, that's a whole different story. That's yeah. the money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm talking about when it was just out. We were just tour, out there. Man. I remember. Yeah, they know we got. Yeah. We only making five thousand. What we signed for five thousand. I remember that. I, I'm talking about those times beginning, where beginning. and this is this is who this is you. This is main me main, main have headache. I'm talking about Al. We going to that Al? No Al. Al was in Future. Future was with y'all. Yeah. 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 Future, Future was there. I'm talking about when we go. Irv. No Irv. Irv with the college. This was early. That was volume early. two. So I'm, I'm talking about early. I'm talking about when early, we, early. When we don't even we don't even know we still don't believe in Al one. We right. just think is. Well, yeah, yeah, whatever. Yeah, this is way back. Yeah, I'm, way about, back. I'm talking about when we, like aircraft. When we run into the, when we go into the office and yeah, yeah. still in boxes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like I tell you, we stood out. Well, I got out. I told you, I, I stole up. I ain't know the company. I'm like, yo, <laughs> yeah, we got sneakers in this office. You scheming? Yo, I'll hold me down. I grab a whole box. <laughs> boom. Throw it in the limo. We go to our crib. I'm like, ah, right, yo, I'm gonna bust the box in half. I don't know what's in it, but you gonna it gotta be sneakers of sun. Bust it open, boom. It's like a hundred pair of just right sneakers. Just the right size though. Not the left feet. You know what I mean? Yeah, you know. <laughs> oh, so it was just oh, shit. Oh, oh, niggas, oh, bro. Like, oh, so it was like, so I, I, to this day, I the limo's there, I was like, man, this bum ass company ain't even got two sneakers. <laughs> Do all the sneakers right there in the street. Boom. It was like, man, this, so when AO came, right? When AO first came, um, AO, they talked to me about AO, we in the office, and you know, Peyote got the glass, yep, so yep. You know, AO's there, he's with his boys, I'm talking, and um, Ron and all of them, they're talking, and they, we all talking about the tour, and AO and Philly, and then I'm look up, son say, look at that, look up. I see AO boys, they got boxes, they creeping through. They doing the same thing. Yo, they doing the same thing. They still in box, and I'm saying to myself. Y'all going home with all right feet. I'm saying, oh, they probably got all left foot. You know what I'm saying? Like, but 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 this was this what I'm saying about the tour. Yeah. You know what I mean? The tour was, it was, we wasn't sure about the tour. Yep. We we almost was gonna use the tour for something else. Man. Yeah. Right, we from New York. I'm, I'm, we almost gonna yeah. use the tour, but we almost was like, hold on, so we're gonna be in this city, then we're gonna go to this. Where the bitches? Hold on, hold, 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 on. Nah, hold, hold, hold on, the people listening now. Don't say too much there. No, no, listen. That was thirty years ago. People listening. We, I'm just telling you that me, me personally. Yeah. yeah. That's how I was looking at like, the connects. Like, hold on. Yeah. Connects. Yeah, 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 yeah. So wait, hold on. They don't never search the buses. Hey. Nope. Like everything, like everything was hate. locked down. So you start thinking about like, yo, yo Shane what? talking Frank Lucas shit. Now. Y'all should, he y'all the Frank so Lucas fry. Shit. Yo, what Drake say? When yo, you Shane, land? You, you good, Shane? You got some? Rise here. Big ass garbage bag. Like, what are you doing with <laughs> all this you know, out here? You know what I'm saying? So it was, so it was more of like, then you start, then, then you, because it's a, it's a, you thinking, me process, you think it's a hustle? Like, yeah. it's gonna give me five thousand dollars. I know, <laughs> like, yeah. it's good money, but that that money was spent when they gave it. I took that to the check cash right away. The yeah. check cash took a uh, four hundred off of it. It was crazy when I seen them dudes. They came down to New York. That's when they had a tournament in Brooklyn called Dunkers Delight back in the day. Yeah, yeah. That was they high. came and they started pulling the N one shirts out their trunk, handing them to people. And I was like, yo, what is that? And they was like, oh, this new company that we starting called N1. Oh, but they was in the hood, like, yep. handing out T-shirts and stuff. I was like, oh, okay. And then that shit just... It's still, it just and, and to this day, it's still, to me, it's still a mystery, almost. I know the skip tape is still kind of a mystery because when we went up to office, they had a room. Everybody had a room. Like, you go, is this the shame? That's how they sold us, right? We go up there, first they go to Paoli, you walk in, they go, yo. I look, I'm like, they like, yo, this the Shane and Dribble Machine room. There's a room... There's a picture of me making a move. I don't even know where they got the picture from. Yeah. It looked like West 4th or something, right? Uh -huh. So I'm like, man, this is mine? <laughs> I'm in. Right? That's yeah. Right? So I'm like, uh, uh, trading places. Like, this is mine, so <laughs> this ashtray right here is mine. <laughs> <laughs> so what was the office? Was that here or was the it Paoli. in Philly? Paoli. 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 So, Paoli. Philly. Yeah. Pennsylvania. So, so yeah. they had, the Paoli, first, we, we, all the had, we, had the we all had our court. own, but nah, but before before they upgraded, there wasn't no court. I yeah, remember, I know. Like, I there know. was rooms, they never so so they kind of were selling us like, and that's when, that's when, that's when you start dreaming, like, wow. That's, that's when crazy. me and Maine and half start putting thoughts together, like, yo, you know what? 
you just bigger than what we think it was. Yeah. And 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 for me again, our our goal was like, yo, you know what? We, this is what we could do because we still we late, but we, we gonna use this. We are gonna get the best street ballers, and we are gonna get them to go play professionally. That's what we wanted the tour to be about. Let's go get. Yep. When I grabbed her Octane, I said, Yo, Oct, I got this company. Listen, just get down, get get in shape, stay one year, and try to go overseas. I told every everybody that I got. I told everybody that yep. the life the lifestyle supersedes it. Yep. So knowing that, if you could look back, would you change anything? I was thirty two. You can't tell me that I'm old. Yeah. I, I'm I'm yeah. I'm not in that race. Yeah. I, I, to me, it's a come up. I'm, Just in general, bro. Anything. Not even yeah. about going to the league and nothing. I mean, I'm business wise. Everything you, every only thing, only thing people would have did if everybody would have did is probably got a, a better agent, right? A better of agent course. and made better decisions. Man. But then, would would Air One comply? I mean, my my thing is. It, it, my, uh, you understand? Now, would they yeah. comply? But like, would they take the chance to say yeah? So it's too difficult. Now, what if and one would be like, nah, you know what? That's too much, or we don't want to do it. Well, we're, I think in the beginning, go here. In, in the beginning, right. I think that was the time, kind of to kind of like form like a union. The headache situation, absolutely. Yeah, because was, in the beginning, was, yep. in the beginning, y'all had the upper hand, and then they when they saw, y'all. When, 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 after y'all built it, they was like, oh, we could take a dude from any park in America and make him. Make him a celebrity now. Make him big. So now, oh, y'all want y'all want it, I, y'all want it now? Nah, I think nah. it was more of two once um, contracts started coming in. Yep. When everybody came in with a whole different mindset. mindset. Yep. Everybody came yep. in. Absolutely. This guy got an agent. So he's not, he's talking for, everybody came talking for themselves. And, and that's that's what Aaron wanted to know. Did yep. you ever have an agent? Yeah. Uh, my eyes. <laughs> yeah, word, <laughs> word. Uh, yeah. Like, but see, you know what I'm saying. But again, come where I come from. All I was looking at was, How okay, much? the number. Okay, that's more. Okay. Because me, um, I just said signing. Me personally, people used to get signing contracts. Me, I'm a, I'm, I'm a. I'm a, I am I, I get money, you know what I mean? Like, I'm a hustler, meaning not league, but I'm going to find a way. I'm going to find, I could sign a bad contract knowing it's bad, but I'm going to find a way to make money. Some type that. of way. You know what I mean? I'm going to yep. find my niche in that. So with me, it was like, you know what? Oh, shit. They still messing with me? I ain't cut, sign. Yeah. Yeah, a word? Good. I ain't playing my ankles. I, I can't run a sign. <laughs> <laughs> a word sign, you know what I mean? Yeah. If I sign, like everybody else worrying about everything, I'm worrying about like I'm from from day one. I already knew my. I'm saying I, once I seen where it was going, I already knew how long can I shame? How can long can chain the drill machine do? I can't do that shit, sauce, and I can't do none of that. I can't walk K three. I can't <laughs> roll on the floor. I can't. I can't do none of that. You know what yeah. I'm saying? So for me, it was more of like, but how how can I keep the job though? Yeah. Right? It's like it's like having a job and and you and you don't have the experience. But how so? How do you keep the job? Yeah, yeah. yeah. But I'm personality. So I, once I see how it worked, like me, I, I get in. I'm a Libra. I'm a, I'm a look around. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, this is how you do it. All right. Bam. I'm in there. Yeah. Escalade said to me, "God bless the dead." R.I.P. Man. Um, yes. Yeah, Escalade said to me, yo, Shane, me and you going to be here forever because the rest of these niggas is dumb. <laughs> I was going to lie, but I ain't. Nah. Wow. You got to break that down. What the Escalade do? Who the Escalade? If you watch the tour, who, who, who the Escalade was becoming? It's like the coach. Like the, who, who? Who? The entertainer. Escalate. Who was the first entertainer? Who was the first entertainer? The first face on there? Sauce. No, that didn't bounce a ball. No tricks. Ooh. <laughs> I, you would just let that motherfucker nah, roll. You, no, no. So, you so, 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 so what I'm asking you this is this. You see the little alley oops, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. What else do you know me from? From the M1 mixtape? You let that ball roll. You be dancing a lot. What else? Nah, he don't roll. I'm asking you. Uh, you, you look at all the highlights. Every crazy dribble. Ah! Did did you see a bunch of those from me? Nah. 
I mean, not on the main no, ones. That's I mean, what he's saying. No, yeah. you ain't see none. No, I mean that's like if you start towards the on the TV show, you saw Escalade really doing like he would be the one in the, the huddle. Face. So he the started. Face, with, he would be he the one being, pulling the team together. Doing with me doing so what it is is yeah. we, we learn we learn it ain't the tricks is good, but somebody has to be the face behind that, right? So as good as Sauce was and Professor was. These guys, you put the camera in their face, they wasn't appealing. Sauce quiet. Right, you know what I mean? Not appealing that way, right? Now put a ball, loud, but put it in there, he can't, he, he can't entertain. Yeah. So once 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 I found out, I was like, oh what? Yeah, off off the court. A oh, word, that's all you can that's uh, that's all I gotta do is is say, uh, I never been to college. How you spell knowledge? That's all I got to do. <laughs> I got the, and to this day, got the whole world singing that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Or, or, um, the other joint. I'm really glad they made. That's a, that that went popular. That's a commercial. That's a childhood. Com- that's that's real. Yeah. The Children's Aid Society is something that came on TV every weekend. Yep. All I did was sing it and put the last four words backwards. And it, you know what I'm saying? So people came to that. I, I gave away shorts. I got. I became. I became that. Yeah. But I, like, I, so, I learned. I said, you know what? How can I stay on without playing? Bro, it makes sense though. Now I think about it from a macro position, bro. No, smart. they did cut you smart. out of some shit. But, but they, they did. I but see they that now. No yeah. basketball, but they couldn't because it. You, you because it be they 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 made it a business. And since they made it a business. You could play basketball, but if there's no entertainment, they it, need it the becomes boring. Yeah. So when I wasn't there, and they had that, all these guys that thought they was blowing up, they thought the tour was doing, the tour was shit. Yeah, word. It, it was shit. I forgot whatever season it was. It was it was shit. Oh five. It was it was shit. Win the tour. You know how I know? Because they called me back. Winter tour. This was after winter tour. Some of the winter tour. They didn't call me back to play basketball. They, listen. This was when um, they didn't call me call back. Call you to back play. as a personality, really, bro. Anybody, anytime you say, bro, I know that shit bad because they called me. They called me <laughs> back. <laughs> so they, they, so for, I mean, the basketball that that it wasn't working. You need the personalities. Yeah. You need the personalities. So, and you oh. know, and you know, and Aaron, Aaron was saying no. You know, say no. ESPN was like, nah, we can't even shoot. Because we need, you, yeah, you got to have them behind the scenes stories and personalities. It's not just going to be about Full what's going on. Full fledged business, the yeah. So, so when I, they came, to, so so again, so Mark, I know Mark. So when they came to the crib, man, I, I'm on the road. Um, I'm the only guy at this time. I don't think Sauce was down. So me and Sauce is the only official and one guys that's not on tour. Yeah, right. It's 05. So winter tour. So that means while they on tour. At that time, it's about fifty promoters. Yeah, we're smart. <laughs> we was doing yeah. That 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 won games. And guess who's the highest paid players on these type of games? The and one players. Yeah. And yep. guess who was the only two players? I didn't. It, for, to be honest, it wasn't no competition, cause. You you needed me and Sauce, yeah. so me and Sauce was with Aaron Hope. We on tour. Yeah, I remember that. Boy. Sauce, <laughs> yo, I'm getting two, three, four. You was thousand. on that team, Rise? I'm getting two, three, four thousand. Boy, Sauce getting man. Sauce getting four, five thousand a game, and yeah, we, yeah. We, we it's on, like we on tour. So when the cameras come and one, I sit in the crib. I don't get a cut on person. Yeah, man, I'm just sitting here doing nothing, man. All right, so now everybody like damn Shane. I just got back off a tour. Yep. Yeah. But I, the fans want to know where I'm at because guess what? Maine's calling me. Yep. Uh, Farm calling me. I calling me. <laughs> Ali Mo. Yeah. Everybody's calling me every day of the tour. You know what they keep saying? Yo, son. Yo, we need you here. Yo, they got signs asking where you at. We don't even know what to tell them. Water. And off that note, some of your. Because we've been a lot of places, OG. But some of your memorable tour memories, like stories, like what 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 comes to mind? Because a lot of people want to <laughs> <lot, laughs> A lot know. of people want to know, fam. Which one? It's basketball? Million. What kind of story you want? All of them. Fighting ba- story? Basketball all of them. All, all, <laughs> all of them. Damn, I'm going to give you a funny. Now, I see that. I'm gonna give you a funny story. You got to, man. Minnesota. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck?
fuck was y'all doing out there? I'm not. I'm just leaving the name. Look, let me just say this now. <laughs> a lot of people are there in relationships. This was 30 years ago. I, I'm gonna admit. <laughs> I know. I'm gonna admit. I'm going to admit. This see, I, I, I admit. So the tour, what it did was, I wasn't married, but it kind of it messed up relationships too. I'm sure it did. Oh, dog. Dead. So, Minnesota, we on tour, in Minnesota. <laughs> Me and my man, it ain't it ain't main event. Cause people gonna think it's main event. It ain't main event. But me and my man, so we meet I meet these chicks. <laughs> Go back to the chicks crib. We drunk, skipping, we drunk as hell. Drunk. The chick go to the chick crib, the chick got a, a bird, like a parakeet in a crib. <laughs> I'm drunk, smoke. I'm like, yo, oh, I'm gonna say my man's name. No. 30 years ago. I'm like, yo, Ock. Let's, <laughs> <laughs> let's yo. just say Ock was with me. I'm just going to use that for example. But I'm like, yo, Ock. So the bird get on my nerve, B. He like, yo, we you talking about shorting the shower? I go, yeah. I'm about to put the bird in the microwave, yo. <laughs> <laughs> so, this nigga, so, he's yo. Still, so he's like, yo. No, you ain't. So I'm like, the bird come, I go, you ain't do that shit. I push the bird in the microwave, right? I hit the microwave. <laughs> <laughs> Make try to get canceled, bro. For like, for like two seconds. <laughs> <laughs> the bird, yo, open up quick. Yo, they're in the shower. The girl's in the shower. The bird, come, the bird comes out. She's like it was drunk a little bit. I'm like, oh, I'm, yo, I, yo I, I'm just saying, ah, right? So it wasn't ah. Nah, but you got name drop this now. <laughs> I cry laughing, right? <laughs> <laughs> yo, we sit here. So now that the birds, like they come out, the, the girls are drunk. They're like, hey, birdie, birdie, birdie. But the bird is like staggering. Like I'm like, oh man. So the, like she picked the bird up. Like when she put the like went to put the bird, you know, like let like it fly into the yeah. kid. She was like, she said. <laughs> <laughs> so the bird just dropped. It ain't die though. Just start walking though. <laughs> so it ain't die. So it ain't die though. Start walking. So this is this is part of the funny. The story keeps going. So now it's me. And, I'm just saving Ed with Ock, right? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just using this. I just use the name, but Ock, right? Just, just say Ock. Remember, it's the chicks. It's after the club. I left. We met. We met this guy. Some bug. Um, what was his name? Half dead. I left that part. We yo, met this. Chill, yo. We met this That's white. This I'm guy like. named Half Dead. Half Dead in the club. Half Dead. I don't know who he was, but Half Dead had some weed. That was the best weed I ever in my in my life, and I was like, "Yo, yo, I either leave. He got the weed. Leave, get the weed. You know what, man? Stay with half dead. Half dead got some weed. Stay with him, so I get back. But right? because this story goes on, so now, right? We in the crib. It's one bedroom, one room. I'm on the bed. Let's just say, for example, ah, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's on the floor. Whatever happens, happens. Whatever, right? Two in the morning, I get up. I'm like, oh man, like no nothing. About five. Talking about you got some pussy, right? <laughs> you better got some pussy. You put some fucking bird in the microwave. Hold on, let me finish. Yo, hold on, let me finish the story. So. <laughs> so look, I get up. I'm going to go up to the bathroom. I step down, I'm like, ah oh, man. I'm gonna kill Ock, yo. Look at like a nut on the floor, the floor is wet. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm trying to, because it's dark, I don't want to step on nobody, right? I'm, I'm like, ah! Oh. I'm like, ah, oh, man! So I, get, I come back, I'm like, ah, oh, man. Let's just say it was ah, right? <laughs> <laughs> so the light go, lights on, they on the floor. So he, my man get up, I'm like, yo, you nut on the floor, what's up? You on the floor, was wet? He like, yo, nah. Sucked on shorty titties, yo. She just had a baby. That's all <laughs> mad milk all over the floor. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Lactating like a motherfucker. Yeah, man. Man. 
nasty ass mad milk, milk oh. all over oh. y'all. Oh. I looked down, it was mad titty milk over oh. <laughs> So now, wait. Yo. We got it. It's, it's 5 in the, 536. We got to be at the hotel at 830. We like an hour and a half away. We got to hit the road now. <laughs> Shorty, we got to go. We in a whip. <laughs> we speeding. <laughs> The cops pull us over. I'm like, damn. Let's just say Ack was with me, right? <laughs> I'm like, yo, the cops is. You, if, so if you know about the tour, you know, and like I said, I'm hustling, you know, I got the badge. The yeah. fake, I pull out, I got a, a officer son badge. Nigga, <laughs> dog. No bullshit. Dead ass. Cop, like, they pull Dead out, ass. I'm like, listen. Flash real quick. Look, hey, I'm Officer Sun, man. What's going on? Like, and one, they like, and one? Oh my God. They like, yo. I'm like, they like, yo, the girl you with, um, she don't got no license and you know, all this stuff. I'm like, damn, but we got to be at the hotel in like 30 minutes. <laughs> they was like, yo, so what we could do is what you want to do? Uh, we could let her go, or we could take, or we got, or we could take it in and, and just take y'all straight to the hotel. We already know. <laughs> Take her to jail. <laughs> Yo, they lock her up. I call Maine. I call Maine. I call Maine like, Yo, Maine, call G-Lock and tell them to bring the cameras out. I'll be there in like 10 minutes, in like 20 minutes. We in a police car now. Police car, oh, they pull up, they coming up. I'm in the back, I'm like, Yo, you gotta get me out of here, Case. <laughs> Case, you gotta get me out of here. You know what Yo, they like, yo, what you doing in the police car? The police be like, yeah, man. These guys are riding with this girl, man. You know, yo, she know she have, she goes by different aliases. I'm like, different aliases? Yo, this girl was like some bugged out girl. Was, that's, that's why, I, yo, that was, the bird should have got that, yo, because she was foul. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> but yo, that's definitely one of the, a crazy, crazy story. A crazy, crazy. That's man. crazy. And then we got the Australia story. But I mean. What happened in Australia? <laughs> Now, and that's, this is, a, a, we in Australia, we in a club. Um, it's like a, all, like a white, Australian, no, Australia speak English, so we in there, there's some black, we, there wasn't that many blacks out there like that, that like we seen like all together. So like a black chick, kind of big chick though. <laughs> she tapped like, yo, hi, we, y'all wanna go to an all black party? Hell like, yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah, we, so, let's just say, for example, my man half bag though, right? <laughs> <laughs> right? Let's just say, for example, I'm gonna use half. So half bags though, right? It's a big chick, it's two chick. We go to the other part. So now to the other part is me, main, half, prime, ayo. Hey, Remember this story. Who else was that? <laughs> Spider. Steve Burke. No, 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 Spider was there. And Steve Burke. So when we go to this other party, this club, it's, it's kind of a drive, but, yo, know, we ended up, yo, know, this is Somali Africans. This straight hood, Somali African, black, but it's all right. But we in there, but normally we get love, right? And we like, we get love. The love wasn't really there. Like, it wasn't <laughs> no love. Like, like, we feel the energy, like, damn. Like, it's the love. For, looking like, damn. So, we kind of noticed that they scheming on us. And I, th I don't know if it's because of the chick, but they kind of, like, they scheming us. So we like, yo, like, we huddling up, like, and I ain't gonna lie. I'm like, damn, if it's, it was to go down, it's me, half, Steve <laughs> Burke, man, do they, they, oh, we start taking us, oh, it's going down today, okay? Put our watches in there, so we, we in the club. They, they like staring at us, it's like, one, two, then it gets to 10, then it's like 20. We like, yo, what's up though? Like, we, is it probably like, no, no, no. So we go to the bathroom. Um, AO goes to the bathroom. He comes back out like, yo, I was in the bathroom, son. Yo, they in there talking about how they gonna fuck us up in the bathroom. So we like, what? So we like, yo, let's just stay together. We go by some little area. Unless you know, it just, it just sets off. They start throwing drinks at us. So we got our back. Oh, hell no. Like, it's like a door, but we don't even know behind this door. Yo, the whole, they just start throwing drinks at us. So we just 
throwing drinks. We just, we ain't got, we just fighting, throwing boom, boom, drinks, drinks, drinks. Um, prom, somebody pushed me. And when I fell, I fell over a big bag. And when I fell, it was a big bag. It was about 80 empty Heineken bottles. It was like I had a gun. I was like, oh, y'all want to throw bottles? <laughs> y'all ripped open the bag. We throwing bottles. It's, it's going. I'm talking about, let's get hit. It's Australia? We get, let's get hit in the face with bottles. It's That's going crazy. down. Yeah, they throwing... Look, they throwing their drinks at us, bro. The, they still got liquor, so it's in the, so, and, and we don't, we not going back there. We don't really know what's back there. So Maine, we don't see Maine. So over here is move, 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 move. So we look, this nigga Maine got a mini motorcycle. <laughs> and threw it. Up in the <laughs> air like this. <laughs> yo, that's how strong y'all motorcycle. So yeah. we like, so, so Steve Burko like, yo, 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 what you doing, man? <laughs> this fool goes, nah, cause again, his mom's bugged out. I was gonna throw the bike and then light a match. <laughs> <laughs> Fam, that bitch. No, but look, but with us in the club though. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, we, with us in the, so now, boom, we, we, we somehow we get pushed through this door. It's like bars there. So we boom. Now it's like an exit. So we run, we trying to get out. And as we getting out, it's one Somalian dude must have ran that way. Oh my, we look, this nigga seen us, and they like this. Yeah, man, yeah, so yeah, man. <laughs> Put that phone down, money. <laughs> look, I just looked at him, I said, oh no, I saw you throwing that bottle. Put that phone, this nigga takes off, Phew! runs back, half is coming over. Half, get him! <laughs> All you hear is, bop! We come. Money laid out. We like, all right, he's done. <laughs> they start throwing bottles. We in the club, yo. So we break the door open. Boom. They chasing us. Now it's the whole, now we outside the whole club, yo. We throw bottles. My man Prime gonna say he didn't do it, but me and Steve Brooks, boom, boom. We seen Prime jump in the cab. We like, yo, Prime, where you going? <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. so going Prime gonna deny it. Prime got in the cab. And took the cab from here to the end of the block where the club is at. Right over there. He got right back out. Like, right for the danger. He was like, yo. So now, they throwing bottles. We fighting. Hey, yo, stupid. He drunk. He got like a little pipe. <laughs> he want to stand up in the front. Yeah, what y'all want to do? Y'all want to throw bottles? Bing, 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 bing. They hit A.O. up with the bottles. Right? <laughs> yo, next you know, yo, this is late. We just grabbed the bottles. We start throwing the bottles. And then we was like, yo. Ain't no more bottles, yo. You know what, man? Fuck that, man. We just started going toward them. They started running. So we like, sticks is running. Get out of here. So we, <laughs> yo, we you chased them all shit, back in the club. So now rumor has it, like, this is like some big time Australia thing. So the game, we ain't even, the, the air one game didn't even start. This is before the game and everything. We play the next day. No, no, we got a pre-party the next day. So we like, yo, rumor has it, they coming to the pre-party and it's on. They coming with a million Somalians to tear the tear. So we like, yo, Rod, we call it me. Listen, team me in. <laughs> Everybody, nobody better not be fly tonight. Yeah, <laughs> Nobody better have no new sneakers. I nothing. remember that. Nobody better not drinking. No, we on point tonight. So we at the air one party, all the sponsors is there. Yeah, we, we militant. Yeah, I remember hey, that. Hey, Shane, how you doing? <laughs> <laughs> like, we just watching the doors. Yo, that's him right there. Yo, that's there. Yo, we running, yo, we running down. We got Farm, right? So Farm, my bro Farm is a uh, Farm lead uh, and one knockouts. Yeah, word. <laughs> <laughs> so. Shout out the hooker, man. So Farm. <laughs> We, every time Farm wasn't there, so he's like, Farm mad, he missed the action. Like, so, <laughs> so we got butter knives, we got butter knives from the hotel on us, everything. Cause we don't know what's going on. So every time somebody would come in, we had just run, yo, know, after like 10 people, he was like, man, they ain't coming, man. We tired of running. Then they, then they came in. Yo, know, the dudes came in, they came in like 15, 20 deep. Yeah. What happened? Yo, know, they came in and was apologizing, but the rumor was it, they, they, they thought, cause we was from America, they thought we had security and our security had guns. So they thought that we oh, was gonna have guns. Do. You know what I mean? Cause they don't got no guns. In Australia? 
nah. So they thought we, because we were from Earth, they, so, so they came in to apologize and they, they, well, we party with them. Um, so all that was, so all that was, a, so all that was just a big misunderstanding. A big That's mis- all it was. Yo, <laughs> <laughs> what yo, the? Yo, all that. That's crazy. Yo, almost somebody kick got killed. Yo, the cop, even when the cops came, cause they, all I, all right. So, so what? Part of the fight left out. They fight. Mad you fighting? Boom. They chasing us. Let's just say, for example, half. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Let's just say half was running. Yo, how you get into a fight? Right. You fighting. But you don't even, you ain't letting that side piece go. Yeah, <laughs> But you got it like this, so what the fuck? How you run into the car? Come on. Stay in the car, I'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Yo, like, we're like, word, like, yo, so yo, we had some. That's real. Yeah, we had like some real. That's crazy. We had some missions, like, like we had some funny mission stories. We had missions, that it won't last one, not no funny one, but we, um, we used to, we used to go to the arenas and like we used to go to cities and like again we smoke weed so we're happening to bump into the the neighborhood the, whoever got the, the weed dealer the big weed dealer and we always would hit them with the yo listen they'd be like yo they come out with like 20 dimes right they'd be like yo what you want they got like 20 20 dimes we'd be like all right, all right give us all of those what else you got so they'd be like <laughs> like yeah now give us all of those like Matter of fact, we a boss at. So what we used to do is we used to actually get the the the, the hustlers. Hopefully they can't go back and go to jail. But <laughs> but when we play and and we start getting in arenas, those front rows, those yeah. um, those court side tickets. That shit was reserved. Those wasn't those wasn't for family members. <laughs> my my Duke, you got to sit up there. Uh, the, the butt the butt man need about five tickets. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? He talking about he give up. He giving up five ounces for five. Hey, hey, fast. Yeah. Hey, fast. You, uh, you don't know nobody in this city. Uh, we gonna need your course side ticket. <laughs> hey, sauce. Uh, we gonna need uh, team me. We need all course side tickets immediately. <laughs> we got something going yeah, on. I used to take all my shit. <laughs> no. and, and, and and that and that's how we rocked out. Bro, that's I had my mama sitting in the bleachers too for an hour. And then that's and guess crazy. who we no was, cap. And guess right. who, and guess who we were selling it to? <laughs> the security. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. The and, security. Yo, how you selling them. weed to the security and the bus driver? And charging the guy that's dri- Yo, listen, this one to <laughs> our bus. Look, this is me and the bus driver. Yeah, word. Yo, how long we gonna get there? <laughs> <laughs> like he's smoking. Like, like. I why he driving the way y'all need to go? go that's crazy. He let you drive it. I ain't gonna say his name. Uncle Donnie. Uncle Donnie. Yeah, do Uncle Donnie <laughs> dance. How Uncle Donnie dance? I ain't get on the bus. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm sleep. I'm sleep. Speaking of that, I'm sleep. I'm what? knocked out. We yeah. where we at? Sacramento from L.A. to Sacramento. Oh, I'm was asleep. Freak. And Shane was in the front smoking, but I'm like, damn, who is he passing this shit to? <laughs> So I wake up. I said, ah, Uncle Donnie, what you doing? He tried to fix his curtains. <laughs> Make sure nobody was there so while he was driving. <laughs> and I look back, Shane in the back in the bed already asleep. <laughs> it was fun times, man. Yeah, fun right. time. Even the first, yo, one of our bus drivers quit on us. Yeah, word. In the middle? Mid-tour. When he got to his city. Yeah, he, like, he had well, enough I'm, of y'all niggas. Yo, bro. word up. <laughs> no, he quit. He was like, yo, I'm out. He's like, I'm home. Yo, one bus driver. The bus broke down. He asked us for gas money. <laughs> Yo, what? that's how you know anyone had to be on that bullshit back then. He asked for gas money, bro. I that's first saw a bus that had no AC. That's why you look at the joint. We used to have to ride with the window down the bus. The joint was leaking, and all of that. But yo, it was. But I ain't gonna lie though. Um, like I say, those buses was. That was like having a Bentley or a Jet. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You pull up to the. You, you see that up, shit pull up to the hood. To the park, everybody know it's on. So at the park, the club. Yeah. Um, oh man! The, the, the whole class. Yo, after the listen, after an M one event, that tour bus is getting filled up. After the party, everybody on the bus. <laughs> we was letting yo. One time it was so full, main started throwing dudes bags out the window to make room for seat. <laughs> they threw the camera. He threw the camera out the window. The, um, he threw um Mike's um his medicine. Every, Man, this guy, this in the way. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> word, word, word. Wow. Yo, so, so, so what was, uh, 
we talked about tour moments, but what were some of your favorite street ball moments? It could have been a game. It could be, you know, a player you played against, a game you witnessed, your, your favorite tour stop. You know, what was some of your favorite street ball moments? I mean, uh, what a, I mean, I got a lot of favorite street ball moments, man. Um, give us your, give us your no, it's my, top it's, five. It's crazy, but um, my street ball moments ain't from me, though. Meaning, meaning, it's what I, it's what I, I've heard. You okay. know what I'm saying? What, like, so, um, if you go to my neighborhood, everybody's gonna always talk about the time when I played against um Bad Boy, and mm -hmm. um, um, I think Steph, Steph, Steph Marbury had the ball, and I think I stole it from, I stole it from him, and I went down court, and somebody was running side to side with me, and I bounced it and dunked it backwards. Right? That, that, that's. That's probably one of them. And um, I put a, it's off record, but it just was, but I put a lot of people in the hospital, bro. Like, I remember, like I told you, I remember playing. Your ankles? A, the ankle. I mean, I put, um, just imagine your knee up where your thigh is at. Like, you know what I mean? Like, moments, <laughs> moments of playing to where they had to stop the game. And, like, the ambulance had to come and, and dudes telling me, like, yo, uh, you made me retire from my job, bro. Like, I couldn't even go back to work after that surgery. Like, like just playing defense, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, and D.C. was a dope one. Us, New York versus D.C. always going to be a, a, a dope history because it was some. It was us against Prom, Mucci Norris. Yeah, um, who is it? The, uh, Wiz, um, Kurt Smith, um, Gene Smith, Junkyard Dog. Um, Victor Page, um, the baddest DC legends all together. And we and we went neck to neck to me, Future, Reggie Freeman, and to this day the game never ended. Like we went mm. out there. That was uh, I think that's what what made and one and one wasn't that it was those games. Yeah. Right. So um, you see me and Future and us playing against Nucci Norris and them, yep. and then we go back with M1 Mixtape, so it's solidified already. I ain't nice. gonna, they, I, they, I know they can play, but even that game, and with that game, it was dope because I stole a move from that game, and the move became very popular. And everybody, and I love it because everybody blamed and one for this one move, and I stole it from the NBA player, and I was throwing the ball over somebody's head. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Moochie Norris did that, right? Moochie yeah. Norris was the first person I seen do that. He threw the ball off a future head and, and caught a shot, jump shot. And I thought it was a joke. I took it back to my neighborhood um, saying, I'm going to throw the ball off a people's head. I only did it when it was like point game. I wanted, to, like, I wanted to really embarrass you, so I didn't do it just to do it. I did it. Who catch a jump shot, game. Yeah. I'm throwing it off your head, catching it, hitting the jump on it, and game, right? So I brought it to Ann One, just joking, just with a little kid. And Sauce and Ayo, they seen that joint, that joint was off the head. And the world, yo, if you throw the ball off my head, yeah, they throw fight. the ball off my head. Yeah. That's right. And I used to be laughing, because I used to be like, yo, the NBA guys is killing us. I can't wait to tell them I got this from one of y'all. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So, yep. so like that's that's one thing. Like with the NBA too, is a lot of the, a lot of stuff they try to kill us from. A lot of the moves is from them. Yep, you know what I'm saying. And, and again, play. I played with Allen Iverson in the yep. backcourt. Talk about backcourt. Yep. It was with Fat Joe. I'm um he don't Fat Joe don't talk about it because we didn't win, right? We didn't win. But he was on the Terror Squad team back then. I was on the, the original Terror Squad, the okay. first Terror Squad. But that's it's, it's whack that he don't talk about it. But yeah. to me. That was the best terror squad, right? Because it was the block. Mm. It was Bronx dudes, New York dudes. There wasn't no NBA players. Even when they got AI. So, but then they started winning. But right, he went and got Kareem Reed, Stephon Marbury, yep. Spencer Malou, A Butter. Right, he got a whole bomb squad. So they 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 highlight that point. But they talk about the Allen Iverson. Yeah, well, Allen Iverson played this night, and I'd be like, damn. But he played. With us, when we lost, but somehow y'all yeah. putting them on the winning squad. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Y'all putting them on that winning situation. He yeah. played with us. It was pure. We we lost to go to the chip to um Rough Riders. Yeah, yeah. You know how they lost? Yeah. They subbed the guard out. They subbed me out. And it was over. Can yeah, I, I, Christmas. 
Yo, they subbed me. I'm telling you, I'm saying now, we was up one. They subbed me out. They subbed me out, and I was like, "Don't sub me out. I'm gonna stay with Kenny Satterfield. Kenny Satterfield's a pro. Yep, young pro at the time, right? I was saying, me, he's not gonna beat us, right? I was in my mind. I was saying that because where I come from, only way you can beat us if you touch the ball. Yeah. So I wasn't gonna let him touch the ball. <laughs> I, I'm. That's why I played, but I was like, going like that, you gotta play like that. We didn't, it wasn't no friends. I told you, right. I didn't like main event. I know. I didn't know him. Yeah. I didn't know him. Right. My, my scout report with main event, and my block was, yo, box him out, he could dunk, that's all he could do is jump and dunk, and if anything else, I'll try to hurt him. That was, that was, I didn't know main. Yeah. And none of them, none of them. I didn't, I didn't like main, I didn't like half, I didn't like <laughs> aircraft, I didn't like headache, I didn't like none of them. I, remember, I'm old enough, so I right. watched them coming apart. They was competition. Yeah. Or money from Jersey. I'm not on Jersey, I'm in New York. Yeah. Headache, you know what I mean? Headache was getting good, headache. That's the same, like, no no disrespect, but I, was, I started saying they started getting good, like, that's the same little nigga that came up to me. Nobody want to be like me. Yeah, you know what right. I'm saying. So right. with, like that in New York, that's what's different now. Everybody's friends. We didn't like each other. I didn't. I met Maine. He was already out of college. I met Maine playing on the Showtime basketball team. That's that's how I met Maine Event. Yeah. Took him out. I took him out. We had a great time. I can't tell that story, but I took him out. We had a great time. <laughs> Niggas got wild. Made to be outside. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Took him out. Took him out. That's how I met him. I broke yeah. bread. Took him out. Um, we went to go eat. If you know me, you know. If you know me, is everything is going to be yeah. to the limit. We eating the best. We we eating, we drinking champagne off the first year. We champagne yep. it out. We we we. You know what I mean? We party to the. We get into a. Let's just say not Maine, let's just say another dude, Dwayne, right? <laughs> <laughs> so we get in this, we get into a situation, even with that, like everything is it was I met him and from I met him from an alley you play, right? I met Maine from an alley you play. I played with Mousy Dream Team. He came and got me on the play with them in Rucker Park. Never Kareem V, everybody. I wasn't getting in the game. I no, I played my role, cause I didn't care, cause this was the money thing, bad yeah. boys. I'm like, oh, this money. I could sit, I start saying, I sit right all day, y'all gonna pay me. So the, the crowd is screaming, put Shane in the game. But as I'm watching, I'm watching Maine, and I'm watching, it's like watching home, watching the game where you be saying, ooh, we could have done a pass right there. Yeah. I'm seeing, I'm saying, oh my God, I could make money right here, look crazy. And that's what I'm saying. First play I get in the game, soon as I move on half court out of you. First play, I don't even know him. Yeah. How do you, he catches it? The other team calls timeout. Man comes in the huddle and go, "Yo, that's what I'm talking about, man. Where he been at? That's how we click. Yeah, right yeah. away. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. again, that's only again like we said, street ball basketball, Rucker Park, and uh, uh, just Rucker Park and one basketball. The, it ain't the basketball for me now. It's the relationships that build behind it. That yeah. one round ball, not only did it take you, it, it take you places, but for those who play basketball, I'll tell you, take that ball away, right? And take away everybody you met from that ball and see and, and see who you be standing see, with. Yeah, that's true. Mm -hmm. You know that's what I'm saying? Talk. <clears throat> that's real talk, man. And my, another big thing I think that you guys brought when you on the tour, not just the basketball, not just uh, the culture, but I think as far as too, the kids used to watch the stuff that y'all was wearing. How y'all wore the shorts, the jerseys, the headbands, the wristbands. I and, remember and, and, Sauce used to cut his shirt, the high socks. About that style. You know, about that style. Wait, 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 wait. You see how we looked at each other, right? <laughs> uh -huh. yeah. You see what you said? You, look, because. Wait, wait, you said that. Because. And, wait, wait, wait. You said that. <laughs> and Roz looked at me. I wasn't going to say, but let me just say again. I brought the, I brought that style to the M1. I brought that whole flavor. Ripping I was shirt, dressing dudes. No, I was dressing dudes. Promotion, he. Fam, fam, I had to sh cut off shirt with the dead broke records. Or yeah. I, I played in tournaments back in the days to be different, to cut, to, to slice the to slice, sleeves up. Yep. I did that and have this sleeve off. I came with the, the bandana, the and one. I came with this shirt. I told Sauce, yo, my man, after you do that, yo, you got to do a dance. Yep. You got to learn how to promote. But if you say what I told him, you got to make the, you got to learn how to make it go from loud to louder. Yeah. You know what I mean? I brought that, all that. Sickwood is my man, but 
he he watched me. He watched me. You know, he, he started giving me money. I started going to the city, buying his clothes, dressing. I, I watched a picture the other day. You know what I said? Right. Yo, my son looked nice, man. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Changed his whole style. Sure, you know what I mean? Yeah. Even just, just Cali, bro. He got just, just Cali flow. Even, even the lingo, just the way dudes yep. was. Just, just the way dudes was talking, the way dudes would act. Even the street ball after Air One, when Professor won the contract, I sat there and said, yo, you know what? From now on, if you play for Air One, the minimum, the minimum somebody gonna give us is fifteen hundred to two thousand. If you if you rock with us, you gonna get yeah. five hundred dollars. Yeah. I did that. Yeah. And it and it and it compelled on. So if you if you was a a pharmacist or the younger, the younger guys are rise. You automatically getting five hundred. Mm -hmm. I did that. They wasn't doing that. Nobody. Yeah. They, it wasn't no. It wasn't even no money for that. Meaning, the, right? It was the. It was low money. It was giving guys like that two hundred dollars. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, I. That. What it was was, people just. I know that people are intimidated by me because I. I. I'm. I'm the voice of reason. I'm always gonna speak my mind. Rise yeah. I tell you, I've been on a tour with High Riser, with um another tour that Rise was on, and I'm act, I'm a manager now, right? So. So I managed TJ, right? Me and Main Event managed TJ up there, right? We was the worst managers in the world. <laughs> worst <laughs> worst managers. Didn't right? take a dime from. We him. didn't. We how do we manage you? But we don't. We don't take no money. We get. Yeah, we get. Yeah. We don't. No percentage. Our management. Our management company was to make y'all money. And one tour disappeared. I didn't have a job. Main didn't have a job. We got TJ a job. You know what I'm saying? So that, like that. So like again with Roz. Um, I'm managing TJ on the tour. I got hurt. So, Roz trip. is hurt, right? Roz, I'm like Roz doctor on the tour. You know yeah, I'm word, saying? no. Kidding. I'm like Roz doctor. Roz, <laughs> Roz is hurt. They're on the tour. Um, they smoking. The team is smoking. The promoter of the tour, Linda. <laughs> oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. That's why you talking about two hundred fifty dollars a game. <laughs> oh, bro, that's all she do. Oh, you was rocking with Linda, bro. I came in on like was the N one live shit. Oh, yeah. I was on tour rising. Oh, nah, he wait. Oh, I knew it. Oh, she tried to pay you more money, money for this. this yeah. No, 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 look, chill, 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 chill. Y'all down with y'all know y'all down with the janky promoters. Yo. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. <laughs> but anyway, but anyway, but let me just say, let me just say the story. This was before that. Rise, you gotta break that down. No, but before I know, but let me just say the story. They came when it was live. N one live. The, not, not the yeah. Not, I wasn't there on that. I wasn't live. That's exactly. why I'm saying. So but Linda was the promoter. One. I just finished talking to Farm about this yesterday. And I was we was talking about stories, yeah. right? Like something like this. And I laughed and joked with Farm. So let me ask you, son. Keep it real with me, man. Would anybody want to hear money? They would anybody pay money to hear about the N one live talk? Nah, no. Nah. That shit was overseas, overseas bro. Overseas, you heard about overseas, it. Overseas, niggas, they was, bro. It. I was signing autographs over there. Yeah, no care. The fuck, I'm five seven, dog. You know why? Cause she jerk and ho. Bro, but anyway, I, let me just tell you, finish. Yo, right. I was twenty one then. You feel let me? me? Let me I, I saw that shit. Check this out. Check this out. The M one tour is going on. You meet you meet promoters that do local games. I meet I meet this local promoter that does games. I'm in the business. I'm doing the games. Everything is good. And one tour is about to start. So if you down with and one, you, you can't play. You can't play no more. I tell this local promoter, listen, I'm going to help you out. I'm going to introduce you to some other guys that you might could deal with and you could pay for them. And I'm going to help you out. It was Linda. Yeah. Right from the beginning. Nigga, you I said 250, 500 but, a game. But That's anyway, so, so, so she didn't want to pay. She was like, yo, uh, team me, everybody. Sound. I'm finding everybody. Woo -woo. Yeah. That nigga came <laughs> You tell us, you tell how I came downstairs. Shane came in the room. Linda, let me holler at you real quick. In front of everybody, right? It brought all the players. What was that, your room? Yeah. Because it was, it was smoke in there. <laughs> He's smoking. Linda. Right, well, Irv, Irv came. Irv a just had surgery yeah. on his knee. He was managing A up there. He said, Linda, TJ need his money now. Ain't no fine and we all grown. Irv, you're going to pay Irv, too. You, and you got to give me extra because I'm coaching. Because the last time you coached us, you lost. I'm coaching. Oh, yeah, and Riza, give him all his money up front. So I'm looking like, damn, you know, Linda's like a mom to me. Damn, this nigga finna get me sent home. <laughs> Later on that night, Stevie came to the room with damn sure all the money. And he told her. And after that, no, it was no more fines. It was no more. So, listen, I'm a boss, we man. Can Bosses smoke, don't... We can smoke. How you gonna find she was like, bosses? She was like, 
me and T, he said it. He was like, me and TJ will leave right now. And she already gave them all their money up front. We was on the second game. We had like 13 of them. That was, yeah. that was like a 10000 Yeah, that was a come. good one. Real good one. Oh, Linda broke y'all off? Yeah. I told you. I don't, I don't, I don't I, you're not jerking, Shane. I got, I got my five. Dex. Hey, man. I want to know what Linda got on the back end, because if she paid you off, like, yo. Well, well we know. <laughs> listen, we listen, know what dog. was going on. That's yeah. what I'm like, bro. I want to know what she get on the back end. Exactly. But we, uh, I already knew, excuse my French, I already knew we, I was getting screwed royally, because you got to remember. Because she's saying, yo, Roz ain't going to get all this. And Ghost, Ghost was with us, too. And Ghost didn't so, get a but no fucking one, dime, So she's saying bro. Roz can't get his money, because Roz got to not. I'm like, yo, hold on. How you can't pay? You, how you not paying a man that got hurt on your tour? Yeah, it was. You got hurt. You, if you can't, if you're not gonna give him money, you got insurance. So she in the room. She, she basically started like telling me like, Yo, Shane, can we talk in private? No, we gonna we gonna talk in front of everybody because you, what happened was, um, certain guys, they they messed the game up, right? Yep. Like I said, they. Um, they started hating on us and one guys, right? They started hating on us. Other street ball legends too. Some of my guys, some of my, I'm gonna blow them up later. But some <laughs> of my guys, because it's, cause it's foul though, because what they was doing was, and, and, and it fucked up the whole market to this day, was they were called Linda, they or they are called Dex, they are called somebody and say, listen, Underbit. yo, why, you got the N1 guys, why are you giving them 3,000? Yo, I could get you a whole team for 3,000. Fucked up. And, Messed it all And up. as a promoter, you saying, I'm going to get this bag. And and, and if they started undercutting, knew what they did. all they did was they started making, they paid $100 to it. So if I got a whole team, if I got a team for $3,000, right, and it's eight of us, how I'm getting paid? <laughs> yeah. So what happened is that guy who's setting a deal, he's giving you 100 you 100 you 100 you 100 and he's walking and that one guy who's saying that's joke he's walking off with four five hundred dollars so the market got so messed up that yep. you call you be like yo they ain't calling shane they ain't calling Maine. they ain't calling rod they gonna call yep. somebody that then 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 the, the high guys they started taking the 200. yeah 200 I, yo i ain't got no money ain't you taking 200 dollars bro and that's and that's what killed street ball falls on the air what we did with Aaron one down on the street ball, again, at the same side was, what I can say what Aaron was did was, we opened up the gates for people to get paid. Facts. Mm -hmm. Meaning, meaning, not just your top street ball player, because back right. then you gotta, you had to be like a pro. Yep. Like, now anybody could make money playing this, right? Team Flight Brothers came right behind us. Well, everybody, everybody's building off of what Aaron one did. You got yeah. ball is life. What they doing? Taking five guys to the park, filming all everything. the old and we met one them, players. And we met them, and me and thing, main, main event, and I had something called Ball for Life. Yep. Yep. And, it, and we repped that all the time. Ball for Life, Ball for Life. And then they turned around and made it Ball is Life. Yep. Yeah, we I remember just, that. Um, we just, remember Ball Up? We Ball just, Up came, and they took N1's whole thing, uh -huh. too. That's when ESPN did one well, down. So now again, with the Ball, ball now, For Real tour now with before the, that. Yep. Now, now even with it? the Ball Up thing, right? I hate to say that these guys that played with Ball Up. All them guys that played over there. One of my guys came to me. And he said, yo, yo, you know, uh, such and such a Murray, it was right? That's the name, right? He goes, yeah. He told me he met he met the he met the Air One guys. And know what he said? This is my guy. My guy told me, he said, yo, he said, yo, I met the Air One guys. We about to do something. I ain't know they was that stupid. Word. That's a fact. This when that so when, when they when they was doing that ball up stuff and I'm and they they kind of thinking dudes would be hating. I'm saying to myself, fam, I know y'all not getting paid. Nope. My man know the man yeah. who know the man. Yep. He told them he didn't even know y'all was that stupid. And he didn't even know, they don't even know I know. Yep. They know now, yep. Shane. They, they, they told me. They I know, know now, Jack. And, and then it broke and it, and, and ended, right? Yeah. I heard, it's how I heard it ended. I heard it ended where you don't, I don't got no money for you, but I can get you a blue check. Yo, chill out, yo. I don't got no money for you, but I can get you a blue check. That sounds like Linda. I ain't got no money for you, but I get you to Russia. So, I ain't got so, no money for so, you, but so I you get go, you to Germany, so nigga. On, <laughs> so if you go on Instagram and you see certain players with blue checks, with blue checks, that's what they took instead of money. Ooh. Yeah, a lot of them did. Mm. A lot of them did. A lot of them did. 
We might have to start Man. that list too. Blue checks over the ooh. That's what that, that's again. Uh, so that's what it, uh, it's like. It's like certifies. Like we talk about street ball certified. It's like Instagram, right? Instagram, Instagram was dope, right? Right? Because everybody got a blue check. They certify. Yeah. Once you start seeing those blue checks, the uncertified people, it watered down the brand. So, yeah. So, so that's what happened kind of with, with, yeah. with, yeah. with us, with us, yeah. with us, how they started looking at us with Aaron One. Y'all certified, but once y'all stamp, stamp and people. these guys, yeah. right? Like sourcing them, right? Like it was, we was getting backlashes from the, uh, the, the real street ball legends, the, the Pee-wee, college players, yeah, yeah. no, the younger verse, the younger guys, yeah. like, 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 not saying, but like, a, like, the, like, not Kareem Reed, but on those type of love. And the backlash was like, yo, we not, they not mad that we we promote Aaron one, but we promoting them that word legend keep getting thrown yeah. in. Yeah. Cause that was my thing too. My, my, my whole thought was, were guys, just like we were saying that Rucker, when you play at Rucker, you know, a lot of times you get stamped. That's why a lot of NBA guys like, yo, I got to go play at Rucker. So was it, did you feel guys were stamped before the tour or when you made the tour, that's when you was, okay. It, uh, even, when you made it, even when you made the tour and you stamped yourself, it wasn't okay. So what happened was we, um, the gift and the curse was we brought somebody on the tour. And this person came on the tour. You gotta start name dropping, bro. I'm never going. I'm, I'm not. It can't beat me. <laughs> so, <laughs> word up. So, so I'm just getting to it. So we brought somebody on the tour, and this person that we brought on the tour, he was a legend. He was legendary for giving out what names. Mm. Big Tango, right? So, and those names became famous. So when Duke came on and start throwing out the names, mm-hmm. it I wasn't the was... same as how we got the names in Rucker. We got y'all at Rucker when it was We got stamped. us after yeah. game, after game, after game, right? Yeah. You had to earn your name. Yep. When Duke came, because it was a job, you get your name that one night. That one night, right? Okay, you're this guy. And they would keep it, right? And they would be like, wow. And run with it. No, no, think about what I'm trying to tell you. <clears throat> Who stamped me? The legend. Remember, yeah, I tell you, legend stamp it. So if Duke Tango say to you, This right, is your name. Yo, yo, you. That's the stamp. You, you gonna know what you're gonna say? I'm a legend. What? I got Duke? stamped by a legend. Yo, that's cool though, because Duke coming here on Friday, Saturday, one I just of these would, days. I just would do yesterday. Sunday, Word? Sunday. So, but you, but like you saying, that that's when it started getting watered so, down. So, so, and directly, if you, if you, if you think of it, right? Because now dudes are getting named. Every like night, this. yeah, because yeah. it's a business. They taking yeah. any nigga from the hood to right. make them big, right? So now in the rucker, if you wasn't that good, right? Like that, you came out there. Uh, my my man went out there. He looked at garbage. No, there was dude on a stick. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's, like, that's that call, dude, see? right? They, right? They was calling him dude on a stick. But with yeah. Aaron one, you don't you don't get that. You get you gonna get a good name. You gotta because. The, the upper people, we need names. So we didn't, yeah. but we didn't, we, I saw it, me and Maine, we was like, damn, man, you can't be kids just giving everybody names. Dude, can't. Dudes should've got the weight. We got, they should've just started calling the dudes by their real name. So who are those dudes that got names that shouldn't get, that shouldn't have names? That's on the tour? They all came. Just I mean, who, who you think? Anybody. But no, 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 Fest got a name. No, Fest got a name. No, no, you can have your name. But that name doesn't. You're just saying it doesn't. You, you shouldn't stamp you as a legend. Yeah, it doesn't solidify you. you. So, yo, the legend. fest thing is actually interesting, right? Because, like, yo, like you, you in that second generation of like mm-hmm. the mixtape players, right? Mm-hmm. Y'all came in when social media was getting big, mm-hmm. and so from what I heard from Fest, he just kind of started a YouTube channel. So a lot of times when you talk about like being stamped as a legend, that blue check mark, some of these dudes have big followings and stuff like that. Yeah. yeah. So fest is different. Fest is. But no, no, yo, no, wait, wait, wait. Also, no, we're meaning this. Fest, again, I said this on the last joint, right? Because it, 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 I got emotional talking about that. It's not that. It's those games that you're watching on TV, Fest hitting a buzzer beat and this and that, and then we got to come to New York and play. Well, Fest didn't understand this. If, if you want to become a legend, you got to hit a buzzer beat every night, fam. All right, you hit the buzzer beat there. All right, so what? They want you to play in Rucker Park. Right? They want you to play over here. They want you to play over there. So we, when they want him to play in Rucker Park, 
hey, yo, hey, yo was like, nah, nah, he ain't letting him play, letting him play, he ain't letting him play. Because he was like, yo, I ain't going to let y'all do that to fest. You don't think he could have hold his own? You got, you got to go. You got to. You got to go through that fire. Yeah, if you gonna come yeah, yourself a legend, to. I think he can hold his own. Well, hey, he, he got to. No, no, do no, it. no, no. He could. No, he could. No, he can't hold it. Why? Why would? You, why do you think that? I, listen. I, let me I, just say this to you. I, I've seen let me, the fire. Let me say this to you about so, Professor. So. Wait, wait. Let me just say this to you about Professor. It's not. It's not not Professor. Professor is a very good, fundamental sound basketball player. Mm -hmm. But let's not forget. And anything you do in life is something called levels. You cannot be at a level up here and you, if you're not on that level. Um, the fans put Professor on the higher level, right? The followers, the fans put him up there, right? The problem was his job was to let them fans know that he's not on that level. It was his job, it was his duty. If you stand there, if I'm right here right now, and you talk about some legendary basketball shit to me right now, and Pee Wee Kirkland and Joe Hammond sit next to me, I'm gonna step to the side, bro. Don't I'm not gonna I'm not gonna I'm not gonna not I'm not gonna not do that. What happened was Fest, he found he found out the YouTube situation, from what we heard, right? He found out a way to get on the YouTube stuff. And he took advantage of it. Right, he took a bear, which was great, but that's that's marketing. That's not that's not street ball. That's business. Yeah, that's not street ball. That's just business that's and marketing. Right, he coming from. so 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 that's that's what he that's what he did with it. But what he did wrong with it was, you ready? Yeah. If it wasn't for us, that brand you two wouldn't know who he was. What he did wrong to me personally, what he did wrong was. We fought, I was gonna, we fought for Fester, physically fights. The motherfuckers trying to play Fest. Yeah, right? Physically fights. Cause physically, cause they trying to chump him. We fought on the court, the court. So when he did get that connect, he never hollered at nobody to say, yeah, Yo, you know what, y'all? There's something coming out called YouTube. I think y'all should get up on it. You think he knew at the time? Because in like 05, 06, niggas was on MySpace. It was a whole different niggas who were thinking that. Your phone, let, all let me ask son, let me ask you like son, let me ask you son. I ain't arguing no, with no, you. No, 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 no. If you are, you're going to lose. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't there, nigga. No, because I'm at, cause I'm going to say that. I'm, I'm Yeah, it's, something is fresh in the beginning. Like, like this. Yeah. This right here. No matter what y'all tell me, Yo, don't tell nobody, don't do that. It's my due diligence to tell my brothers. Facts. Right? Re regardless, on, on every situation. That's principle as a man. At, at one point, first, when you don't know sun's popping, but then you see it starting to be popping. You can't let brothers know. You, when you tell, yeah. you, you, tell, the you big, tell us after you three million in? Yeah, because the big thing, man, just imagine if social media was big when y'all was on the Thank tour. Thank you. Oh, my God. God. It was MySpace. We just used it for the wrong thing. The wrong thing. I mean, yeah. like, like I'm talking about to date, like with Black IG Planet. And, was, yo, and 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 and, and, and the way booty and, 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 we used to run, yo, yo, this was yo, listen. And one, we used to run, listen. Yo, where we gonna be at? Yo, we're gonna be in uh Seattle. Oh, let's hit up MySpace. Yeah, hit up MySpace and see what's going on in Seattle. And and we ain't know how big that was. Yeah. We could have used it for, like you said, we could have used that for marketing and the brand. But we, we didn't. Nobody just, knew. Yeah, no. Yeah, we, yeah. Yeah, we just want to find out where the, yeah, where the clubs is at. Yo, what is this now? What is that? Um, What's that chick name that used to be on everybody praise? Sam Samaya, what's her name? Yeah. yeah. Samoya, what's her name? What's her uh, name? Love Hip Hop? Oh, what's, uh, so, what's her name? Samaya Reese. 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 Yo. Samaya Reese, yeah. Somebody. I didn't know she was super big. Yo. I, yo, I was trying to find my old MySpace password and get on there so I could show all the messages. From like, so it was, it was like- Yo, you stupid. Not real talk though, nah, <laughs> nah, real talk though. So it was like, we didn't know about that because we, we used it, we right. used it, we used it differently. But yeah, imagine, yeah. imagine if they had IG and TikTok back then. It'd been a rap, right? Dude, yeah. Live, going live Ooh. on the bus. It would have been Radio crazy. stations. And, that, and that's the thing about international. Yeah, yeah that's what man. I'm saying. It was sick over there. I you remember. You know what I'm saying? Was... I mean, we had it, and I hate to say it, we had it. We just ain't take advantage. It was yeah. called TV. Yeah. Right. It, it was bigger than that. It was like we, we, it was we rolled on airplanes and riding jet blue, and watching the TV and the money next to you like this. Like yo, you look familiar. That's you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? So we, like I said, the, the part with that was missed. Like game, like with fest. 
like I said, like with him, like with the, it's just the street boy. The business wise is great, but I just me me personally, I just think what what but taught why what made it like that was like Dex said earlier, we didn't union. So since we didn't union, it didn't bring no brotherhood and no disrespect to Fest. Fest ain't one of us. Ooh. So, well, okay, not one of the originals. Culture. You talking about culture? Culturally wise. wise. Culturally so culturally wise, wise okay. he's not gonna. It, 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 he's not raised like that. He wasn't raised like that. When Fest got on the tour, he got on. We helped him out. We did everything we could do. This for me, pros. We did everything we do for him. It wasn't no. It wasn't really no get back to him. his pops came along. Right, his pops came down. What does pops do? <laughs> what does pops do? He sold his jewelry. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I forgot about that. His pops did have a, right, got so, a jewelry right, store. Right, right, So God was buying jewelry. So so I, I'm not saying nothing bad about that, but I, me, me, I, I look things in the third eye as like they, yeah. didn't, they didn't forget sell us the jewelry store. You know what we're doing. Put us in the jewelry business. You know what I mean? But it's, it, they, it's I call it blood suckers. It's like they got all they got in there and they just did they get off to the races. He don't speak to me right now. So you think it was intentional that he didn't let y'all know about like no, you know, not YouTube and shit is popping. Y'all should get on. This. I think I, I think it wasn't intentional, but I think he, he's he 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 he, had, he definitely did everything selfish, his own selfish ways. Professor is the only street baller that played on Air One mixtape with us that never played in a street ball game with me. Mm. Yep. Never mm. told me I don't do games like that. Mm. And then. I seen him doing games like that. Yeah. Told me, like recently he said, as it's good, because I hope he hears, he said me and Maine was bullies on the tour. And I was like, damn, bully. Right, how old first? Y'all the Yo, same, same age, age, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Professor, but but when he said that, it kind of bugged out. I was like, damn, what? I don't think I don't think he know what a bully is. I got marinated on this. I'm gonna be like that. Y'all take a shit? I got, <laughs> I got you. <laughs> no, you know what I'm saying though? Yeah. Yeah. So that's like, crazy, man. So like he said that, like we, like, like, that's why we started speaking. He said, yo, you are like a bully. I was like, a bully. Y'all went back to instance like then. When did I have a bully first? Um that's, yeah, that's, that's crazy, when they man. when they made Fest pick the black doll out. Remember we went on tour, everybody had the dolls, they gave Fest a black doll and they did all of that? That wasn't my idea. Uh-uh. When, when they, when they, when headache, when they did all that, all that stuff, I just was the guy laughing, but it seemed like I was the bully. You know what I mean? But I was the guy that I was more than a protector with these guys, mm -hmm. like with fessing them, meaning fet. I was the guy that sub out. I'm the guy that say your sub out, go on there and do your thing. But other guys don't want to sub out. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know. What What, what do you? Uh, would you say? Well, I'm not gonna say a legend, but I think people talk about him like that. But I don't think he's a legend. What do you think about like guy like Bone Collector, like Bone? That's my guy, Bone Larry. That's my guy, Larry. So yeah. that, 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 it's crazy. Ball. I call him Bone, but I call him Larry. So Bone. So I don't think Bone's a legend, and my no disrespect. No I mean, disrespect. Wait, 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 wait. No it's because it's a different type of legend. Because I'm saying the reason why I'm saying that too is because Bone is. He's in the um, top greatest um, joints with, with me, Ruck indictment, indictment. Yeah, right. And the reason why I say that, because... Like, he grew in Rucker, right? Well, because... No, well, no, no, let me I'll tell you, let me tell you, let me tell you why Chris I say that, though. Let me just, before we yeah. keep that thought, why I say that. It's hard for me to say it because, personally, I know who I am, but I don't, I don't consider myself a legend. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? So, so um, I hear, I hear, I don't hear... I hear Cali stories. Okay. And I, I love, I love, I love Bone, but when talking about guards and this and that, when we go on that other end. Right. Oh boy, I hear Kenny Bruner name. Word. Oh, Kenny Bruner. KB. He tough. He tough. Right? McDonald's All American. I hear, I hear Kenny Bruner name. Bad Sam. And, and, Shout out to Bad Sam. And, 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 and even, what's he the tough. name at the time? And Bone is great. Bone is good. Even with Bone, but. Sick. Sick. Like, again, like Sick. Those, those, those certain people, certain guys that. Who I feel that's good, they tell me other, right? They they be like, yeah, like they they almost be like, yo, like almost like he was killing up there, like. But playground legend, playground bone. What bone came to Rucker Park and did was phenomenal for for a short term. Cause I actually seen bone 
before he came to Rucker Park, Bone came into Menacing Gym. Mm -hmm. And he, yeah. it was guards in there. Yeah, eating them alive. Three dribbles only, game, one-on-one. -on -one. Three dribbles, one-on-one. -on -one. Three dribbles only. And he was throwing the ball between dude's legs. Yep. Three dribbles only. So what, what he brought is something I never saw. Is that, and they, even Sauce ain't do it. Cause Sauce, doors, though. No, 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 Sauce, bone board between the leg combinations. I've never seen somebody yeah, throw the, between the dude's legs. Like three bone, times. Three, four times. And lay it up, yeah. And and, 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 and freeze you. Like yeah, bone, doors. Like uh, bone free, bone. Can't as, nobody I'm not saying that. that he's not a legend, right? But what I do say about bone, me personally, I don't think there's nobody at Bone back then at his best coast to that coast. can guard Bone one on one. Nobody. One yep. on one in front of him. And they cannot guard his doors. Yeah, yeah, that has nobody can guard that. His hesitation is on another no level. No pro, yep. no I, nobody. I played and I'm older and, and I was like, damn, first time I played against him was um All Star game. And the uh, and uh, where was that? Atlanta, same same thing. All star game in Atlanta. I didn't have nothing to do with it. I I called me like, yo, Mark Edwards got an all star yep. game in Atlanta. I'm like, word, yo, he giving up, yo, he paying me five hundred. Word, you got Mark number? But it it. Next you know, ah, you getting a thousand. I'm going. I'm getting fifteen hundred. Maine's going. He's getting fifteen hundred. So, but we get. But anyway, we get to this All Star game, and I'm looking. It's dope. I'm like, yo, yo, I just, yo, yo, I just had like a, a you know me. I'm robbing a pot. I'm hurt. I was. I'm the guy that get must get shot and go to the game and like, you know what I mean? Or or got a broken, got a a broken broken leg and still go to the game. When I get off the plane, I'll be. Damn, I just messed my leg up right now. You know what I'm saying? So that's me. So we playing against Bone and Bone and the other team. I'm like, damn, I'm looking at the matchup like that. I gotta guard Bone. That's what I'm saying about something. Right? Like, but it's my man. Right. <laughs> so I'm like, your bone. I'm giving them rules on what not to do, your bone. Listen, you ain't doing it. We ain't doing all of this stuff. <laughs> so he's doing a hezzy, right? So he has me, right? He has me. And he goes by, and I'm like, damn. Yo, he has me, but and, and on the hezzy, it looked like you. Yeah, it looked look, like. I did, look, I did. Look, like he did the hezzy move, and all I did was this. Look, and this thing was laying it up. I was like, yeah. <laughs> I know, I know. I'm gonna do. Let me back up, back up. <laughs> Nigga hezzy me again. Oh, let me back up some more. I, yo, I kept. He kept doing. I was like, yo, this nigga hezzy is retarded. Yeah, yo. yeah. It's, it's retarded. <laughs> it's like, it's like it's really like he already free. Sauce got it, but his is. Yeah, Sauce got it, but not now like his bones, is right? definitely on another, another, another. But I don't know about see when, when I be in legends, I be, I think NBA ready, man. So I don't know, man. Yeah, I mean it, it's crazy story that uh, my partner, my I man, my I man know, Chris. I, I need to put this. I need to know more history on Bone, not for, I'm not in Rucker Bow and Cali and the stuff that he did out there because it ain't what you do. It's at home. Then this ain't Rucker, out, bro. No, yeah, but Vin, but at Cal, you got Baron Davis. Yeah, yeah, all of them. That's yeah. Kenny Bruner. That's what they all played against. You well, see, I don't I, like. I said, Venus like you said, Judy. I don't. That's what I'm saying. I haven't heard of him playing uh, the Drew and all that. But uh, who, like Kenny? I said, I'm thinking Venice. We 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 had we had oh. my, me and my partner Chris Rucker. We had a tournament called the Rucker Pro Am, and John Stark sponsored the team. That was the first time Bone had come to New York. He pulled up the Rucker Park, had on a bubble jacket in the summer. I'm like, yo, what is wrong with this dude? <laughs> is that when he had the uh, bone had nah, the one side like, burn? Yep, he? yep. <laughs> bro, he, he still so got that. It, it so, was cold up there. Yeah, so then he, like I said, he he started. He was playing in our tournament. Then he went. He started playing the EBC. But like you said, I've never heard anything about him playing in the Drew. So I don't. I don't. Like you said, I don't know. Yeah. But that jerked me in that tournament. Yeah. How we jerk you? That jerked me in Rock tournament. How we jerk? That jerked me, man. How? <laughs> you, you, who? Who I gave? Who gave? You know, you know, I got a championship in there. Yeah, yeah. You do know I got a chip in that. Yeah. Main got the MVP. <laughs> How main get MVP, bro? <laughs> they gave look, main the MVP. It was three MVPs, three, two, three different. They gave all of them the main. I was like, yo, my man, I just had about forty-five assists. Yo, I have yo, literally a sit out of you. But you, but you know, you come on, you know, in the game. 
even though the guard thought he assist, who they always looking at? The, the dude that catch it. They ain't yeah, looking at the guy that, that set it. Always. They ain't never looking me, at that. He know me my share. And, 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 and we won the championship. I already was mad that I that, that he got all. Oh, I was like, damn, even, even man was like, damn, yo. Yeah, yeah, we should split this in half. Yo, we killed him. But I got backlash behind that. Couldn't play in 55th. Yeah, because that... God, God bless, God bless the dead. If you played in God bless the dead, but they, in, yeah, they started. He started banning people because uh, he stole. He told us, "Yo, uh, I don't know, I don't know, you know, I can't let y'all have a good night at y'all tournament because y'all might, y'all might shit. kill my shit." But is it? But it so he started. He started banning dudes, but it was different nights. Different. He was Monday through Thursday. We was Friday and Saturday. Whoa. Yeah. So, so after we won, I come back. Yep, it's the it was playoffs. Crazy. Yep. He telling Lord, yo, Shane can't play. Because he played, yeah, he started banning people, but it, what? it was all good. I was, I was it right. was all good. It it's was just more good. warm milk. Check but, this out. Yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Don't no, we was just saying, you know, to end this, we want to know your top 10 legends. Street, street, street ball, ball legends. Street yo, ball so legends. We're not even yo talking shit. about. I mean, it just depends. Remember we talked about it before, like, it's going to be the people. same thing, man. You got to. It gotta be an era, bro. Cause if you do it, do the second generation, our generation. Nah, bro. I feel like you go just. It you rank them, dog. You can't cause it's the it's the it's the same. All you gotta do is look at the first ten people in Sports Illustrated. Word is born. They was the only one in the mag. In no, the, the first. No, it's gonna be. Mm -hmm. if, if you do that, it's gonna be Joe Hammond, yep. E.B. Kirkland. Uh, hey, yo, Royale, you got this. We gotta keep. We gotta keep track. Joe Hammond, Pee Wee Kirkland. No, no, wait, let me see. It's gonna be. Joe Hammond, P.B. Kirkland, Earl Manigo, uh, Fly Williams, uh, Herman Helicopter. He was the GOAT. Um, Super Kid. See, his name I ain't going to know about. Lonzo Jackson, Super Kid. Mm -hmm. Let's see. I'm just giving you something up to date y'all might know. Terminator. Yeah, yeah. Right? No term. Uh, yeah, I know. Master Raw. Mm -hmm. Yep. Right? Master I'm just Raw. give you some names that y'all might know. Uh, Pookie Wilson. Yep. Yep. Uh, Darren Mack. Yep. Mr. Excitement, D yeah, Mack. I know. Australia. I'm a little younger for I some know, of these. I know, I know, right? So, 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 so I would, and it's more, but though, I would give like, like those, but now if you say in my, my era, uh -huh. right? Like my, from, 50 years under. That's, yep. you know what I mean? Yep, yep. Now say that for 50 years under. Okay, those so your era, yep. So. List two, Royale. Mm -hmm. That I see with my eyes. And I'm going with like my own eyes. Yeah, yep. John Strickland. Yep. Yeah, yeah, of course. That's cold. Of course. Rest in peace. Yep. Lloyd Nesmith. Yep. Future. Mm-hmm. Beast. Charles Jones. Lamont Jones. Oh, yeah. Tick. Yeah. Yeah. Jones Brothers. Yeah. Mm -hmm. CJ. Bo Booger. Yeah. Oh, Booger's always is a soul in the hole. So, so let's remember, I had people talk about uh, Air One was the first dude that Nah, so no, yeah, so no. And and it, and they did they did what we so they did what we didn't do. Biz was on there too, wasn't it? I was in Queens, right? No, no. Brooklyn. 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 But so then you got Booger, so you got uh, I Old would say Arnold Bernard. Mm -hmm. Ooh, A Train. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Conrad McCray. I was just getting ready to say that. God rest the day. Yep. Carl Hines. Yep. 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 Kareem Reed. Yep. Gotta give it to Kareem. We got one more. See, yeah. Skip is uh, 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 Skip's an icon. Is it? Skip, I think Skip Mount Rushmore. is like on his, I mean, he's part of it, but I think he's like the upper echelon. With? And let me tell you with why. With Joe Hammond in him? And Pee Wee in him? I've never. I think to make that jump from there to go to the Eastern Conference Finals and to what what what? Skip had what seven turnovers his whole no, entire career. Not more than that. But what we gonna do is this. What, we gonna, yeah. No 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 no. I'm not trying to play this. No what what no. Because I want to real quick before we end. What we gonna stop? 
We're going to stop painting a narrative saying strip, I mean, Skip to my Lou made the NBA from street ball. We're going to no, stop No, no, he went to Fresno. No, he went to Fresno. He went to Fresno. Fresno. He, he, number one point yeah, yeah, guard yeah, yeah. in the he nation at one point. Ball. Yeah, he, right. Man. Listen, what Skip did was he took the local route. Yeah, yep. Damn right. Street ball. Yep. He went to Joe. He went to Joe. That was college. just a hobby for him. Yeah. Uh, that's he was the number one point guard in the nation at one point, and I remember watching this. You know what I'm saying? I remember so, watching so, him so in Orlando. Like, like, and, I, and I'm pretty sure he, he, he'd probably say the same thing that because when it's because guys like that, Skip and Stefano, when you when you when you when you put that tag on them, it's dope, but they kind of take it kind of bad because it it, it it keeps them in a box. A little bit. You know what I mean? No, no, no. It I keeps, understand no, it, that it part. puts them in a box because if we could do it part two, I'm gonna talk about the time. That I posted on Facebook, who had the uh, who had the better handle, a better son. And I put Skip, and I put Booger, right? And people were saying Booger, woo woo woo, and Skip took that shit personal. And I never and I never understood. Booger older than Skip, right? No, he took it personal by Why putting up, so? by putting up a comment. Right, a sub, a sublim, a sublim, a sublim to comment <laughs> to me. Right, I like said, uh, this is at least a, uh, this Gatorade. <laughs> <laughs> they put in a comment saying like, all the work he put in, right, NBA with, the, with with this NBA shit, NBA fine, but that's that, and we still comparing him to a street ball guy. Ooh, yeah, that's that hit hard. No, no, hell, but no, but I get it now. Yeah. I, so that's what I'm saying. So some people like that box after a while when you keep yeah. telling them that it's like, damn, you keep going like dog, like. But what 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 a lot of people don't understand is at one time, and one, we had forty percent of the dudes in the Everybody. league wearing and one, and it was it wasn't because of the brand. You know what it's because of? It's all. It's because of them. I know. I, so I, dudes want to be a part of that culture and the trash talk we had teams. Drug, and the, listen, I had the local drug dealers in my neighborhood. They was making thirty seven thirty thousand dollars every day. They wasn't standing out there with Gucci on. They were standing out with and one. Yeah. I walked into a, I walked into a weed spot to buy weed. In the spot of the weed spot was an and one poster, bro. Bro, that's to this day, bro. You know what I mean? Like, like I mean, a, a poster. And the guy, when I walked in, he was like, oh. And I was looking like, yo, this dude got a poster yeah. on this wall. Yeah. Yo, one cars. last thing. One last thing. What was your what was your favorite sneaker to wear when you was on tour? Which and one sneaker you thought, yo? Them KGs. Word is KGs. born. KG. No, why? Because those was the closest things to the Jordans. Okay. That, that, With that, the that, 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 which one? What year? What oh, year? the low. The, uh, oh, the, I don't know the name. They were silver with the oh, black. Silver. Yeah, Golden. them was crazy. Look at the John Jay. If you go to John Jay, you know, I had that game when Conrad and them was those playing. Those sneakers, because the shoelace was underneath them, right? Sneak, yeah. You those, couldn't really those tie. Which ones is he? Yo, they was like was slippers. The, they those, was crazy. Those, no, oh, we the, we oh. no, we played them. No, that, but what I'm saying is. You couldn't see the shoe strings. They was yeah. underneath so, the shoe so strings. And it had a zipper? Nah, no, 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 no. But it was just underneath. It was just underneath that okay. had a patch so on it. It was crazy. So those were the shoes that they actually gave to us that I ain't gonna lie. First ones. That we all really was like. Yeah, them was dope. Jesus crazy yeah, them, right here. And bro. they was the the most yeah. comfortable. Yeah, those. I forgot, if I could know the name of those. So right now to those days, right now, I would play those. Those was the. And not the Tai Chi's? Nah, those were the Tai Chi's. And the Tai Chi's chi was cr I was yeah. killed in the Tai Chi. Nice. My feet hurting them motherfuckers, dog. Right. I don't know how y'all playing them. Yeah, I, I, I got, killed in the Tai Chi's. I made a suit them. I, they, they, that, 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 that messed up leather, B. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that yo. That wasn't good, B. That leather wasn't good, yeah. Yo, shame, man, bro. I'm saying different about the last one. Know why I knew real quick? Can we go in there? I knew why about the N one. I had a pair of the Air Ones that we wanted to tour, and then I had a pair of Speedy Claxtons. That's yeah, why them I knew was she dope. was different. Speedy His Claxton was cushion, lever, everything. We had the same one. I was like, yo. But the ones they made for him. With the, with the, with the, that's what made, the insert, that's what the made me learn about the sneaker game of yep. saying, yo, KD ain't wearing those. It ain't the same ones yeah. you go buy on the shelf. Right nah. Nah, nah, nah. Way nah. different. Way different. Way different. Yo, yeah. Shane, bro, we appreciate you, man. Yeah, like man. Dex Thank said, you, bro. Uh, 
episode we one. You, stamp, baby. This ain't about flowers, bro. We stamping. We stamping. Like, you know what you I mean? You a bona fide. Where's that? Right there in your pocket. Bro, you don't need one. <laughs> <laughs> no, Boys, that, what kind of stamp is the one you lick? Hey, yo. Hey. I'm out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Why motherfuckers always got to take it there? <laughs> hey, yo, Shane, that hat light up, though? Turn that shit on. I'm from the hood, play. We play real loud squid games. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so you got, you can't just walk in the neighborhood. Not hey, none, that's none, a wrap for the first one, baby. Yes, sir. Great job, man. We got AO in the building tomorrow. Oh, AO gonna be here tomorrow. AO in the building oh. tomorrow. See Hunter. You know he said he hate New York, bro. He said every time he came here in New York, he said he go right back to Philly. He might not even play. He, he don't did? give a fuck. Madison nah, Square he, Garden, what? One forty fifth. Remember that game? When he hit the game winner? Yo, yeah, yeah, yeah. My man, A, Aaron to the O. To the O. Six, Hunter. That's my dog, bro. That, when y'all speak Aaron, ask Aaron, what was him What was him and Prom doing in Atlanta when they had that gay uh, festival? <laughs> I mean, not, not A, yo. Let's just say it was A, yo. Let's just say it was Prom. <laughs> He's an idiot. I ain't speaking on that. I ain't getting canceled. Now, Me now, neither. Now, now, Cut. Now, ask, now ask somebody when he flew in the Cut. water, though. You got to do that, Appreciate though. Appreciate you, OG. You heard me? You got to bring up the part when he when he landed in the water and overseas. Almost died. And, we, and, and we all had to. And we all had to. We all had to. We all had to get it to get it like get him out. He had wild seaweed all over. Him. You know, Ayo was sick for three days. Yeah. Uh, Ayo was yeah. in the water going, prom help, prom. <laughs> <laughs> And t- bring up the fight and see what he say. Ask him, just say, yo, uh, Shane say, uh, tell your story about the fight. In Australia? In Australia. <laughs> oh, yeah. Say less, bro. But, yo, That's appreciate dope. it, and man. And ask him about the time when we was on... No, no, no. No, no, no. Real talk, though. When we was in New York... Uh, one for, which one? Where? The last New York game. The last M1 mixtape tour we did in New York. The, la- the, the very, very last, last one, one before ball. Yeah, I remember. When we had the party. We had that big fight in... That Jim Jones and was fighting it, and Escalade was like, Escalade Professor was there, and I was like, yo, ass, yo, where Fest at? Yo, they was guns was drawn, and he was like, man, I'm about to get some ass, man. Fest over the hotel, lad. But actually, hey, yo. <laughs> God rest his day, man. <laughs> and then they had this, I don't know. I don't know the girl. Allegedly, I don't know some girl. Alleg- allegedly, some prostitute girl. Allegedly. Oh, boy. Yo, I'm out of here. Ask A.O. why he ate her out, man. Yo, oh, oh, baby. Man.